other than, well, Maria Tashibana, but also known as Lafroyag, probably more known as Lafroyag since he uh, participated to uh, Tataki Tuesday and actually managed to win it. So, normally strong, uh, a pretty strong um, Nagori Yuki player. Let's see how he can, uh, how he can manage it. Oh, very nice bait of the burst right there from Lafroyag, even going to get that side switch goes for uh, the wake-up setup. There we go with uh, the very, very big pressure from Nagoriyuki. Goes for the front Fukio, but yeah. DJ Hamiyama holding strong, gets the jump in. Finally gets out of the corner. And oh no, he baited that wake up overdraft. Oh no, no punish, okay. Wow, good lord, that was punish using the aerial overdrive from the DJ Hamiyama. Very nicely done. Je m'ennuyais de ton stream, bro. C'est très tôt ici. Ah bah, je comprends, je comprends. Je comprends très très... Ah, t'habites en Amérique en plus, c'est cool ça. La balle. Mon dieu, bah ça fait plaisir que tu te réveilles aussitôt juste pour regarder euh, la Bourge Cup, ça fait extrêmement plaisir. Oh, but here we go with the wake up overdrive, man! Oh no, the double wake up overdrive! Are you freaking serious? Are you freaking serious? DJ Hameyama, the cojones on that man! The double freaking wake up overdrive! If at first you don't succeed! <laughs> Put yourself up and try again. <laughs> that guy has been freaking listening to Aliyah all his life. <laughs> Good stuff from DJ Hameyama though. Gets the first round. Very, very hype first round. Not going to lie. Oh, but here we go with Lafriag. We tried to go with the snaps. The instant overhead. Well, the quick uh, dust. But here we go with Lafriag. Ah, oh, Lord. And the freak again with the freaking Nasante. Not the Nasante. The um, Ventania. Very nicely done by DJ Hameyama. And here we go, things are not over though! Oh, and the grab! Not enough to get the tension bar! And again with the grab for DJ Hamiyama should be able to seal the deal! Good lord! That was sick, man! First match goes to DJ Hamiyama in a very, very, very explosive fashion, not going to lie. Okay, let's see if anybody called me in the brackets. It should be fine, okay? No, um, no news is good news in French. Bah, euh, yep, yeah, pas si tôt, 8 heures, mais avec un job, ça fait que je peux pas rester trop longtemps, ça marche super bien. Bah, en tout cas, j'espère que ton job va bien se passer. Et euh, puis, euh, j'espère qu'on pourra t'avoir toute la longueur de, de, du tournoi la prochaine fois. Mais bon, évidemment, tu dois travailler, donc euh, c'est plus facile à dire qu'à faire. Mais bon, en tout cas, bonne journée à toi si, euh, si tu dois y aller bientôt. Mais, euh, yeah, to go back to the commentary, here we go with the Ventania again, with the wall break. And first round of the second match goes to DJ Hameyama. Very nicely done. Good lord. Okay, DJ Hameyama ah, getting hit by the close as by Lafreag. Lafreag still in the corner. Goes completely ham. Unfortunately, miss times his. Amiri gets grabbed by DJ Hameyama. DJ Hameyama again with the take pressure, man. Never letting up. Goes for the jump in the safe setup. And uh, yeah, oh, Lafrak trying to push DJ Hameyama away by using the, the the faultless defense, but DJ Hameyama still relentless, sticking to to uh, to Lafrak as closely as possible. But here we go with the favorable trade from Lafrak. Goes for the safe jump, and again, man, with the jump overdrive with punish from DJ Hameyama. He's been taking lives left and right using it, man. Et merci à toi aussi, le Samoy Poly de l'Enfer. Merci, ça fait plaisir. Et on va on to the third match. Let's see if Lafrak can get something started. Goes for the DP. Hits DJ Hameyama out of the air. Here we go with the. Oh, the cannon drill. Finds the opening. Forces Lafrak to pop the burst. Very nice 6p entire right there from DJ Hameyama. Kills the momentum that Lafrak was trying to get. Goes for it. Oh, Lord, what is that? That was sick. He's gonna get a side switch. No, he doesn't. But that was still switch. Oh, goes for the pick cross up. Nice 6 feet from Lafrak. Should be able to get a corner carry. No tension bar for DJ Hamama. Has to hold it. Oh, Lord. The big 6 feet. This big 6. No, oh, no. And the wake up overdrive once again from DJ Hamama. You cannot teach this man. You cannot teach him. You cannot condition this dude. It's so crazy. Good Lord. This man knows no fear. Oh, very nice cannon drill right there. Catches the back dash. Goes for the low S. Here we go with the grab. What is Lafra going to do? Goes for the wake up golden burst. Double Fukio. Oh, and the grab from DJ Amiyama. It yeah, might be just one iteration. Oh, is that going to be another? Oh, it is actually. And here we go with the kill from DJ Amiyama on fire, man. This dude, he is actually a uh, Nagori Yuki. 
uh, main. So let's see how this pans out. I don't believe, well, I, I think V participated in previous iterations of the Rojo Cup, but I don't think we ever had him on the stream, so might be a good first one. Let's see how this pans out. Nice standing P right there to kill the aerial approach from Hoshino. Oh, that big whip punish on the on the behemoth. Oh, Lord. Oh, and here we go with the behemoth. Oh, and the jump in. Oh, my Lord. And Hoshino with the ba the burst bait. Very nicely done. Goes for the mine. Keeps the pressure on. And this should be death right there. Double behemoth. Good stuff from Hoshino. Takes the first man, the first map. Okay, then let's move on to the next battle. Let's see how this pans out. And here we go with the grab from Hoshino. Goes for the overhead. Again, the overhead. Be not ready. Oh, Lord, he goes well this time around. And goodbye, your life. Chibi stab. <laughs> this is going to kill. Fair damage, fair damage. First match goes to Hoshino. Very, 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 very convincingly. Not going to lie. Hoshino is one of the top uh, Gold Wizard players in Japan currently. So please do not be like, um, yeah, you should definitely like expect a lot of very good results from this player. Again, here we go with the forest and the behemoth. Oh, Lord, and Beyblade to kill your momentum. Oh, and Hoshino not afraid to... Oh, good for the minigun. Gonna get the hard knockdown. Here we go back to Hoshino time. High lows. Which one is it? Here we go with the low. Nice juggle, and this should be enough to kill. Good stuff from Hoshino. Also takes the first round of the second match. Is he going to be able to get back some momentum? Oh, gets the... Hit with the clone. Here we go with the clone again. Tries to go for the command grab. Hoshino. Ah, ready for it. But very nice whip punish from D. Goes again for the standing K into the 6H. Should be able to... No, no wall break. But still okay. Should be able to get the wall break and the kill this time around. Good stuff from D. Waking up a bit. It's not going to be free. This is his message to Hoshino. Here we go with the 2S. Very nice 4K right there from D2. Yeah, to hit Hoshino while he probably was expecting the command grab. Go with uh, the... Oh, the back dash. And D, no anti-air right there. And you are going to take a lot of damage. D, forced to pop the burst. Very nice XP. Get the knockdown. And he goes for the 2S. Oh, Lord. Now you're afraid. Don't get it. Don't get it. Here we go to the 4H. Oh, Lord. And the freaking check from Hoshino. He's got the corner positioning, and here we go with the grab from D. Almost got the bait on the... No! No! And he got it! Not enough to kill, but you are in jail, sir. But here we go with the bar from D. Manages to take it from the skin of his teeth. One match apiece. Good lord, D with the correct answer right there to just... a bar, a bar all his life. Good stuff. Anyways, here we go with the start of the third round. Not the third match, I'm sorry. Uh, D with uh, the whiff 2S, but still okay. Hoshino not ready for the whiff punish. Get the behemoth from far away. <gasps> wow. D forced to pop the burst. Almost ate a cross up. Uh, behemoth. Here we go with the behemoth into the mine. Hoshino going ham. Wants to keep the pressure. Very nice bar from D. Oh no, gets grabbed by Hoshino on the way. Gonna be hate to see it. And here we go with the mine. Ooh, almost got the over it. Nice bar from D. Goes for the double. Fukio, but Hoshino was ready with the 2P. Very nicely done. Get on to the second match. The second round, I'm sorry. Okay, and D. Yeah, trying to catch Hoshino pressing some buttons. Good lord, here we go the behemoth. Oh! I almost got the juggle, but D. Unfortunately, ah. Uh, unfortunately for him, he dropped it. Wire to air in favor of uh, Hoshino. Almost got a juggle. And here we go with the corner positioning. You hate to see what are you gonna do? You have to hold it. Yep. Yeah, dice key vision just right here. <laughs> just right here on the left. Good stuff from Hoshino takes the second match. Okay, D is in dire strike. Definitely needs the following match if he wants to send the loser, the winner's racket. Here we go to forest. Uh, D trying to find the opening. Oh Lord! Still good! D went for the jumping D and even had the time to squeeze in another aerial attack which hit Hoshino and kept it in the corner. Wow, the judge defense on the minigun, man. Was so close to get hit. Very nice 6HS. Uh, 
Hey, you're going to do age. I couldn't quite confirm it, but it should be okay. Yeah, I was well, probably not gonna pop the burst with that difference in life right there. Okay, D still not out of it yet. Let's see how this spins out. We go with the start of the round with the DP. With the Beyblade, too far for the 6 HS on the ground. Nice confirm from Hoshino. Oh lord, and the backdash on that freaking behemoth. Oh no, that was a bad burst. That was a bad burst. Wow, uh, how did he block this? I do not know, but yeah, this is death. This is death. Nice, Kevision. Oh no, okay, he went for a reset. Oh lord, yeah, you have to hold it. Ah, uh, too far for the 6 H. Oh, Beyblade, stop running from me. Why are you running? Why are you running? Stop running from me, sissy. <laughs> you cannot run from me. Here we go, the 2S. Uh, uh, D trying to. Oh, not enough. Oh, no, I got the bit on the burst. Not enough to kill, unfortunately, for him. But this can go down to the wire. Oh, no. And the, oh, and the clash on the 6B was so hype. Hoshino's still alive. Oh, on set point, by the way. Oh, here we go, the checks. The 2P checks, man. Oh, and the overhead. The overhead again. I oh, mistimed it, but it's still okay. It's even better than what he hoped for. And this is dead? I don't even know. This is level 3, so it might kill. No, oh, it is dead! Good lord, nice division right here for Hoshino. Good lord. How to keep versus caffeine? Who is going to be the best Jacko we shall see? Let me see uh, why the Pokemon didn't work. Ah, here we go. It did work. That's strange. What did it work? Ah, here it is. Ah, yeah, eto. Peizuri san, eto. So desu ne. Point o ichi o henkyaku shimasu no de. Pokemon de nakatta nde, moshiwaki nai. Tama ni wa chotto okashiku natte, eh, komando ga nakanaka, eto. Nani? Eto, kikanai kara ichi o henkyaku shimasu. Dome nakai. Okay, here we go with the wall break from Haruki, who is currently having a pretty hefty life lead. Let's see if he can keep it or if Caffeine is going to make a V comeback of the year. <laughs> here we go with the mirror. This is the, the definition of a mirror right there. <laughs> oh lord, here we go with Caffeine actually managing to get a pretty nice comeback right here. Is he gonna manage to do it? Oh, just almost enough to get the kill once the... Ah, he got the YRC! He was looking for it so bad. Good stuff from Caffeine. Gets the comeback, man. Haruki must not be happy. Here we go with the start of the round 2D. Okay, and here we go. Back to the zoning game. Who is going to get the better? Oh, set play. And for now, Caffeine definitely looking pretty good. Has Haruki right in the corner, right where he wants him. Goes for the overdrive buff. Nice tech right there. And the clash yet again. Oh lord, 2k2d, my best friend, very nice throw from Haruki. Wow, managed to actually prevent Caffeine from killing his uh his minion body. Here we go with Caffeine in the juggle. Goes for the low. YRC from Haruki wants to get out of pressure. Goes for the 2k2d. Oh lord, oh no, oh no. What are you gonna do? No punish right there, oh. Okay, back to the air. Haruki uh, getting a little bit, yeah. In dire straits, it gets opened by the 2K2D again with the clash. Oh, actually, no clash. Good stuff from uh, Caffeine managers to take it, to take the first match. That was pretty explosive, not going to lie. Anyways, here we go with the second match. Hopefully, Haruki will be able to make a comeback and to reverse the uh, tide of battle. We shall see. Here we go to take pressure from Caffeine, forcing Haruki to pop the burst. Haruki out of the corner, forces himself, uh, forces Caffeine also to pop his own burst, and it's back to the zone in game. Nice jump in from Haruki, gets the knockdown, unfortunately pushes Caffeine out of harm's way. But this time around, he's got the corner pressure, goes for the low, and doesn't get the corner. No, no, no! Unfortunately, a little bit too late on the BRC right there. Caffeine was already with his move out, gets the juggle. And here we go with air caffeine in the house, y'all. Gotta get the kill with the OTG. Good stuff from caffeine. Up one match, one round. Here we go with the zoning. Caffeine trying to find the way in. How to keep being a little bit like more passive, I suppose. Doesn't want really to move forward. Ah, and just as I say, this manages to do so, but gets 2k2d by caffeine. 
Caffeine with the corner pressure. Goes for the grab. Again with the OTG and he goes for the quick dust into the illusion driver. Is it this gonna kill? It might. It isn't actually. Almost got the kill. And here we go with Haruki with the entire very nice close S. Okay, very nicely done. He manages to force Caffeine to pop the burst. Firstly, Caffeine's uh, uh well, yeah, Caffeine's uh, minions were buffed right there. Couldn't quite get killed in just one hit. And that is how Caffeine managed to take the second match as well. Let's see what Haruki is going to do on the first during the third match. This is his last chance to. Potentially not fall into the loser's bracket. Very nice with punish right there using the uh, sending H. Here we go with it. Oh, the pressure is real. Oh, very nice entire from Haruki. Actually, that was Haruki. <laughs> was getting pressured. Anyways, here we go with Haruki. Almost got the... Oh, he catches the backdash with the 2D. Ah, uh, Caffeine trying to bait that burst, man. And here we go with the burst from Haruki. Caffeine's still sitting pretty nice with his own burst. Yeah, free of the minion. Manages to get rid of it. Very nice 6 period there from Haruki. Oh, Lord. No more minion. Haruki finally being a little bit more active. Finds the opening. Ah, oh, fails to get the the, 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 the the conversion. Ah, the minion, the pesky minions. You have to listen to them. Okay, and Caffeine... Looking pretty good. Has two minions on the screen. Just needs to find one hit on a block. Can't really find it to be quite honest. Back to the zoning game. <laughs> Both players being extremely patient, man. Oh, Lord. Here we go with the jump in. Haruki on the verge of taking this round. Here we go. Goes and gets it with the quick dust. Very nicely done by Haruki. Finally. Finally puts one round on the, on the board. Still not out of it. Oh, nice 6 speed from Haruki. We go with the pressure in the corner carry. Oh, Lord. Very nice 2D from Caffeine. Gets the juggle in the corner carry. Goes for the cross up and the juggle and the side switch again, man. So many side switches. We go with the buffs. Haruki said, no more. Sir, you will not kill my minion. Actually, I don't know which buff this is. But... Oh, no. The 2D counter. This is going to do some damage. Is it going to kill? It's not. One more hit from Caffeine for him to take this round. Oh, and the low for the kill. Here we go. We are on set point. Is Haruki going to manage to take at least one match? We shall see. Big duty counter. And you hate to see it. And the corner pressure is real. Here we go with Haruki. And with Caffeine and the corner pressure. Gonna get the wall break. This did a lot of damage. Oh, round start to the... Nice grab from Haruki. Ah, oh, manages to get... Oh, the opening. Forcing Caffeine to pop the burst. Haruki still has a burst, though. And here we go with uh, the armor. <gasps> wow, that was a death right here. Ah, uh, no entire... No! Caffeine on the verge of taking it. <laughs> here we go with the mirror. Oh, look! Okay, nice kill from... For the... The minion end gets hit by the Akuma fireball. Good stuff from Caffeine Takes It. Uh, I do not believe he can speak English, though, but his streams are fairly, uh, are very, very interesting, actually. Very strong uh, uh, Salt players who get to see a lot of Salt text that not uh, many Souls tend to use, and he's very talkative as well. If you speak Japanese, I fairly recommend that you check his uh, stream out. Uh, that being said, here we go with uh, the start of uh, the round and already Roar applying a big pressure on Fortsu Boy. Two boy going for the DP, unfortunately. Tried to go for an empty low, but mistimed it, but still, okay, still has the pressure going. And Lord Roy not afraid to pop that. Oh, Lord, no DP. Okay, and here we go with Two boy going for uh, the Roman cancel extension. Very nice 6P from Roy. Goes for the bandit, and oh, Lord. That was a mistimed wild throw. He could have gotten the kill, but I think he didn't believe that it would have hit. Which is the reason why he Roman cancelled it right after. Okay. Ah, and here we go with the pressure from Tsuboy, man. Oh, finds the opening and gets the kill. Tsuboy not out of it, man. Very nicely done. First match goes to Tsuboy. Let's see how this pans out. Did I update the predictions, by the way? I think I did. 
Yes, I did. Multitask. Okay, here we go with the safe jump. Big counter right there from Ru should be able to take it. Okay, boom. Yes, he will. With a big puff near the guts. And a perfect at that. Very nicely done by Roy. See how this spins out. Here we go, the bandit. Oh, the DP and the block strings. You hate to see it. Roy forcing. So boys pop the burst and gets the jump in. He's gonna get the corner pressure. Very nice for us. Finds the opening. Here we go with the wall break. Yes, we do. Suboy's life hanging on by a thread and he gets hit by the 2k 2d and 2d revolver. First match goes to Roy, very nicely done. Let's see if Suboy can find an answer to this overwhelming pressure that Roy is currently applying. Okay, well, on to the next battle. Oh no, the Meta Blade got blocked. Fortunately for Suboy, he did have the burst. That being said, he oh, very nice grab right there from Suboy. Seeing that there were a little bit too many gaps right there from Roy. Ah, Tsuboy getting the entire good stuff. Here we go with the Gunflame. Nice with punish from Roy with the forest. Uh, should get a juggle. No, I know I got DP from Tsuboy. Should get the wall break. Kaboom. Yes, he does. Let's see how this spins out. What is Roy going to do? Roy. Whoa, Lord. Got open and the big confirms from Tsuboy. Should be able to get the wall break. And he will, obviously. What is going to be the mix? Goes for the save jump and it gets the kill. Good stuff from Tsuboy. Not out of this yet. Hopefully, he'll get this one as well. And the big 4S scouter it. Oh, Lord. Nice. Wait, but it goes for the overhead. Okay, goes for the uh, fully charged dust route. Usually, you see uh, chip players go for the uh, wall run combo. Oh, and the wake up DP from Roy. Big counter hit. And the wake up 6 speed from Tsuboy. And again, a counter hit from Roy this time around. With the revolver, gets the juggle. Look at the damage. Look at the damage! Poor Chip Slime just faded away. Oh no! Here we go with the moon hit. Oh no! And he gets the kill with the overhead. Good stuff from Tsuboy. Puts one on the uh, puts one on the board. Okay, what is what is he gonna do? We shall see. What is Roy gonna do? We're still looking pretty good, not gonna lie. Here we go, the safe jump. And the DP in the block string, forcing Tsuboy to pop the burst. Again with the forest counter hit, man. And Tsuboy just running in that forward as man. Big, yeah, Volcanic Viper into the juggle. Not enough to kill, though. Let's see what Tsuboy is going to do. Gets hit by the delayed bandit bringer. Roy takes the lead one round, though. It's not that big of a lead, but it's still... It's still... Oh, we take these, we take these. Oh, again with the forest, man. Tsuboy has been running in that forest for all his life, man. It's crazy. Okay, here we go with the setup. Finally blocks the DP. Damage time. Oh, decent damage, all things considered. Oh, Lord, and the forest has been 6 speed. Nice blocks from Tsuboy. Gets hit by the revolver yet again. And this is not going to hit kill. Oh, no, it runs into this forest, man, again. Nice force this time around from Tsuboy. Immediately cancels into the... Oh, Chun Chun, come on, not close enough. For oh, no, and he went for the blue Roman cancel combo. The instant overhead. Players be playing Eno, but not Eno, man. Players be stealing the text of Eno's. <laughs> instant overhead. <laughs> that was just a good stuff from Tsuboy, man. Not going to lie. He goes for the overhead again. Finds the opening with the 2k 2d. Oh, Chun Chun, come on. Good stuff from Tsuboy. What is the mix? Goes for the safe jump. <laughs> Again, man, with the... Wow, that pause, though. <gasps> Almost got the bait on the burst. And that 2D on the bandit revolver. Here we go with Tsuboy going ham. Going with the double red. Too far to get the kill. Ah, good tick pressure right there from Tsuboy. Takes it with a perfect. Nevertheless, shifting the tides right now. The tides right now. On the verge of sending Roy in the loser's bracket also. Good stuff. Let's see how this spins out. Here we go with the cross-up. Nice stick pressure right there from Tsuboy. Goes for the grab, man. Getting cheeky, aren't you? What was that? Oh, maybe he read a back dash. That being said, Tsuboy going completely ham, man. And Roy looking a little bit overwhelmed by the speed and the freaking pressure that Tsuboy is applying. Oh, you can see, man, Roy popping that 6 speed. And Tsuboy finding the opening. Be careful there. Oh, Lord. Roy finally getting something again with the forest counter hit, man. It's been working so good for Tsuboy, for Roy. 
That being said, Roy find the opening, gonna get a wall break. But Suboy has two tension bars, man. Lord, good with good, good punish right there from Suboy, gonna get the kill. Yes, he will. One more round for Suboy to send Roy in the loser's bracket. That, that is pretty freaking impressive. What is Roy gonna do? Oh, Lord, and the Forest again counter hit, man. It's been working so good for him. Very good with the late Bandit Bringer. No wake up DP from Suboy. That DP, no DP. Saku Young, Kyaku, but you got it. Oh, Lord, and this should be able, yeah, to get the kill. That being said, Suboy does have a burst for the next, and perfect. <laughs> good luck, what you can do, I can do better. Good stuff from Roy. That being said, Suboy does have a burst. Roy still doesn't have one. Um, Again with the forest, man. We go with the ski. Oh, tried to get the jump in, but Roy was already in the air when he tried to attempt it. Very nice confirmed from Roy. Goes for the RC extension. Should get, be able to get the wall break. Yes, he does. Not enough to kill, obviously, but we take these still. Oh, the 6P, man. Yeah, th that tick pressure from Roy has been really, really problematic for Tsuboy, I feel. Like the pauses that he has in his game, probably to bait the DP, the eventual DP that Tsuboy might pop at any moment, is probably like messing around with Tsuboy's, uh, Tsuboy's brain right now. Very okay. Here we go with the with the burst and the grab. Tsuboy not afraid. Careful, DP. Okay, goes for the overhead and the DP again in the block strings. Man, not afraid. A very nice 2K 2D and 2D command. Good the overdrive. Good stuff from Tsuboy. Oh, Toy, to to come on! We go to save jump and the DP again from Roy, man. Nice with punish. Forcing Roy to pop the burst. Ooh, that was close. Careful, careful. Oh, he got money, oh man! This should be able to kill. Yes, he should be able. Yes, he does. Tsuboy on the set point. Let's see if Roy can save it or not. We shall see. The pressure is all on Roy right there. Well, I'm um, Tsuboy as well. Good run up 2k 2d. We go with the overhead, and again the DP man, oh good lord, and again the overhead man, you cannot condition this man. And Tsuboy going straight for the wall run combo, look at the damage, holy freaking lord, that did a ton of damage. Ah, nice to to the roar, is out of burst, oh lord, is this enough, it should be enough, yes it will be, and... Tsuboy sends Roy in the loser's bracket. Good stuff from Tsuboy. Said you Capital versus Arania, Japan versus Taiwan. Let's go. So Arania probably, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure without the shadow of a doubt, strongest Jacko in Southeast Asia currently. So let's see how this pans out against you Capital. Very strong high player. Here we go with the jump in from Arania. All right, off the bat. Oh, gets the DP bait. Unfortunately, he doesn't get the... The punish, you hate to see it. Here we go with Yuka Pero. As the corner pressure tries to find an opening. Goes straight for the quick dust. Tries to bait the burst, but Arinia not giving it to him. Rightfully so. Oh lord, and the Ford BRC into uh, the punish. Very nice jump in from Yuka Pero. Goes straight for the overdrive. For the kill. Good stuff from Yuka Pero. Gets the first round very, very convincingly. Okay, let's see if Arania can bring it back. Go straight with the uh, start of the round 2D into the... Uh, well, for a counter hit. And Arania has their set play. Has a couple of minions on set, but Yuka Pedal got rid of all of them. Goes for the close S. We go with the Fudra Dark. Oh, find the opening with 4S. And gets the shimmy, man. But Arania... Oh, what was that confirmed? That was sick. One hit confirmed from you, Capero gets the knockdown. Ah, tries to get that burst, man. Oh, gets the whip punish on the TD. Oh, here we go, the secret edge. But unfortunately, didn't get rid of the minion. Quite the contrary. Arnia not out of it yet. <gasps> and the freaking cross up TP, man. Well, actually, the DP managed to hit the, the cross up, uh, the, the, the jumping attack that Arnia was going for. And actually, it's uh, this. Hikapiro takes the first map very nicely done. That was sick. We go with the direct lock, corner carry. Very nice bar right there from Arania. And again, Hikapiro with the shimmies right there. Oh! The Fujira Dark to blow away the tech attempt for the uh, throw. Arania gets oh, open left and right, man. He's looking pretty dire, but Arania not out of this yet. 
You got their set play. Here we go with the O corner. You can put up though. Got the side switch with. Uh, oh no! Couldn't quite get the kill, but it's still okay. Goes for the quick dust into the Roman cancel for extension and the kill. Good stuff from you, Capello. What is Arnia gonna do? You Capello looking very good today, man. Oh lord, here we go the 2k. Arnia and the grab. Yes, the jump in. And the conversion goes for this fully charged dust for the wall break. Here we go with the forward BRC yet again. Oh lord, almost got the juggle. Ah, this is gonna be a punish. Yep. Very nicely done by again. You kept it with the weak of DP, man. He's been doing a number on Arania, not going to lie. Oh no, you kept it with the mistime uh, grab. And just like this, Arania gonna take it with the Legion Driver. This is going to kill. Yes, it is. Okay, Arania not out of it yet. Puts one round on the board. Let's see how this spins out. Very nice for H. Counter hit. Oh lord, that's 6 speed though. We go with the guard point. Arania trying to make his way. Oh uh, no, that's 6 speed though. Okay, no wake up DP this time around. A very nice punish on the stun dipper. And oh no, almost got the juggle using the minions. But it's still okay. Arania going very, 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 very uh, slowly. Doesn't want to get hit by the DP, I'm sure. And here we go with the grab. Arania takes the second match. Very nicely done. One match apiece. We have a tie, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see how this spins out. And on to the next battle. And you cap it. Oh, getting hit by the 2D counter hit. Ah, no jump in right there from you Capito. Arena finding the opening. Well, finding the pressure. The jump in. Wow, got the bait on the burst. You hate to see it. Oh, but here we go with the wake up DP from you Capito. He loves doing this. Here we go with the Fudra Dark. Close pressure and the 5HS counter hit. Confirm into the Illusion Drive and not gonna kill. Obviously, but still some pretty nice damage. And he goes for the grab. Uh oh. Nice take from Arania. Not out of it. Not out of it yet. Nice take again. Gets the kill with the 2K. Good stuff. Let's see if Yuka Pedro can change the tide of battle. We shall see. Start of the round. Far HS. We go to close S. Close S pressure. Nice with punish right there. Okay. Back to zoning. And Yuka Pedro finding the opening. Getting hit by the 2K to the of Arania though. We go to stun the pre yet again. Oh, Lord. Nice to bar from Arania, but still in. Oh, uh, still subject to pressure. Ah, uh, nice everywhere from Arania. Finds the opening with the 2K 2D. Oh, gets the back dash. Immediately in the illusion driver. Should not be able to kill, though, is it? Too far. It would have killed if it was right. Oh, very nice use of the minion as a projectile to get the kill. Good stuff from Arania. Puts another one on the board, takes the lead 2 to 1. Okay, let's see how this spins out. Very nice with punish. Ah, from Arania gets hit by the burst, though. Let me update the bracket real quick. Okay, we see so good. Okay, and here we go to counter it into again the illusion driver. This is going to. Break the wall into a heavy knockdown, but Yucapito is on the verge of having Roman cancel. It's okay, gets hit by the OTG for the kill. Perfect for Arnia. We are on set point. Who is going to take it? We're going to four. Oh, Lord! Nice freaking combo right there. Nice conversion from Arnia. Goes for the air to air. I uh, tried to go for the guard point, but a little bit too late on this. Still okay. Oh, Lord! Yucapito being a little bit more active this time around. Here we go with, oh, very nice juggle. What was that? That was sick. Ah, the juggle from the minions, man. Oh, and the stun dipper, though. Ah, nice pickup right there from Yucapito. Gets the knockdown. Goes for the tick pressure. Try to go for the grab. But Arania, man. Oh, no. Arania catching that burst. And just like this, man. Arania sending Yucapito in the loot. Between him and Bridget. So we shall see how this pans out. Joker Slayer, not uh, a stranger to difficult matchups and usually does his uh, homework in order to try to, uh, you know, make it up for it. <laughs> that being said, start of the round, here we go with the Behemoth counter hit. Of course, that's all we take. That's all we need. But good stuff also from Musubiri finds the opening. 
Ah, against the wall break. That was some decent damage, man. Holy freaking look. And we're gonna start finding the opening with the jumping gear. A little bit too far to get anything substantial out of it. Ah, we should be using the uh, fire rodder in order to nullify the effects of the mine. That being said, Joker Slayer doesn't want to get hit by the yo, obviously. Oh, here we go to 2H. Ah, Lucy Booty is in. Ah, no anti error right there. Ooh! No 2HS, but it's still okay. Lucy Booty finds the opening. Ah, the 2HS was a good read, but a little bit too early. Ah, nice big cross up right there from Joker Slayer. Ah, things are looking pretty good for him. Oh, no, gets hit by the 4HS. Oh, very nice. Oh, here we go again with the Roger to nullify the mine. Oh, no, it Oh, it gets hit by the 4HS. Counter hit. Good stuff for Musubiri. Gets the kill. On to the next battle. Let's see how this spins out. Ah, try to read a jump in from Joker Slayer. And this time around, Joker Slayer finds the opening. With the jumping, with the jumping, uh, with the jumping deep. Again, gets hit by the 4 HS. Here we go, you have to guess. Here we go with the set play. Good stuff from Usuburi. Air to air in favor of him. Of them. Oh, the second hit of the, the HS. Finds the opening, count it. Oh, very nice to HS. Should be able to get the juggle. Not going to be able to kill though. He goes for the set play, finds the opening. Ah, not enough tension bar to get the Roman cancel. Too far from. Oh, but still goes for a raw, raw, uh, raw dust for the kill. Good stuff from Usuburi. Gets the first kill. Get the first match. One match up for Usuburi. Let's see what Joker Slayer is going to do. What is he gonna do? Here we go with the jump in. Usuburi with the setups. Oh, tries to go for a cross. That was so cheeky. Okay, nice juggles from Musuburi. Oh lord, here we go with the air to air. Oh good, entire right there from Joker Slayer. Oh no, and the air to air again. Oh, okay, here we go with the trade in favor of Joker Slayer. Keeps the corner positioning. Ah, forces Musuburi to pop the burst. The mine is out. Oh, air to air. Here we go, Usuburi getting the... Oh, good stuff from Usuburi. But gets hit by the 6P. Joker Slayer looking for it. Found it. Ah, but that being said, Usuburi does have two bars of tension. And here we go with the quick dust. This should be able to kill. And it does. Nice combo from Usuburi, man. That was sick. Good stuff. I didn't even know that was a thing. Oh, the jumping is real. Joker Slayer gets the knockdown. Oh, uh, tries to go for a grab, but missed times and he gets grabbed himself. Very nice pressure from Usuburi. Keep the corner positioning, gets the counter hit. Gets the burst bait and the juggle. See? Okay. Usuburi decides to keep the bar for future uses. Ah, oh, Lord. Oh, again with the 4 chest. Oh, here we go with the quick. That was sick. Good stuff for uh, Musubiri. Should be able to take it and takes it. Very nicely done by Musubiri. Uh, takes the second match as well. What is Joker Slayer gonna do? One more match. If Joker Slayer doesn't adapt, he'll be sent in the losers bracket. And here we go with the six P counter it. Usuburi still with the corner positioning, gets the opening. Ah, nice air. Oh lord, almost got the conversion! Gets the 2 HS count! Uh, gets the 2 HS entire! Ah! Uh, here we go with Usuburi going with the overhead, uh, the overdrive. What is he okay? Oh, it goes for the rock, my baby! Rock the baby, Usuburi on match point. Nah, Joker Slayer looking a little bit uncomfortable right now. Wow! Somebody getting hit by the Behemoth. You hate to see it. Again, Behemoth. 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 Ooh, tried to read the Bagdash. A little bit too late on that, though. And the Subiri. Oh. Making good use of the Yo-Yo right there. Gonna get the knockdown and the corner carry. Tries to get the bait on the tech. Nice conversion from Usuburi. 
very nice use of Fire Roger to get rid of the pesky mind. But that being said, Joker Slayer. Ah, forcing the to pop the burst. Here we go with that low. Woo. Oh, no, he just. Not enough to kill, though. Oh, and here we go with the air to air grab. That grab was sick from Usubu, but he gets the kill and moves on to the winners. Caffeine versus Arania. Let's see who is going to be the better Jacko player in this tournament. We shall see. So both extremely strong with their own respective character, with, with their characters, actually. Uh, I would have said that previously, Arania would have taken, taken it quite easily, but Caffeine recently has really been working on his setups and on his optimization overall, and he's really starting to become extremely strong. So it wouldn't surprise me if Caffeine actually manages to take it this time out. But uh, yeah, Arania, I haven't been seeing him very often on the, uh, Celestial, um, the Celestial floor. So I don't really know exactly what as well if he's been like improving or stagnating or whatnot. So only this match will tell us probably. But we shall see. Anyways, for now the Oh Lord, look at these kills, man. This is crazy. Here we go, Arania trying to find the opening. Finds the opening this time around, gets the corner positioning, goes for the quick dust, tries to bait that burst, but finally, caffeine popping that burst at the adequate time. Caffeine is a lab monster. Yes, he is. He's a crazy lab monster. Ernie is also pretty good, though. Definitely not to be underestimated. He has some pretty sick uh, guard point setups as well. And confirms. Oh, here we go, the guard point. And Arania almost got grabbed. But this time around, Arania. Oh, Arania getting the knockdown. Goes for the. Ooh, the ID. Almost. Oh, but gets the kill with the soccer kick. Good stuff from Arania. Takes the first round. Here we go with the side switch. Start of the round. Ah, uh, Caffeine. Uh, having some problems finding the opening this time around. Ah, uh, very nice juggle right there using uh, the minion. Gonna go for the jump in. Gets the shimmy. Oh, Lord. Here we go with the quick dust. Grown caps. Oh, no. A little bit too late. It's still okay. Caffeine still has the corner positioning. Very nice uh, Abari right there from Arena gets the uh, the hit. Here we go with the side switch and Arena going straight for the Elysian uh, Trifle. Yo, Flan, how you doing, bro? And again with the Elysian Driver, the double Elysian Driver for the kill. Trifle. <laughs> Good stuff from Arania. Takes uh, the uh, first match, actually. But not quite easily, if I might say. Let's see if Caffeine can shift the tides of battle and bring it back. Very nice 2k2d with punish right here. Ah, that being said, Arania already has the corner positioning. He's down one burst, though. Team Good Jacko is so satisfied. It is, it is, man. If there's one thing I'm proud about this tournament, is we have a lot of very strong Jacko players regularly. Like, you can more or less be guaranteed that there's at least going to be two very strong Jackos in in the Rojo Cup every single time. Very nice YRC bait right there from Arania. Getting the kill. Arania up one match, one round. Let's see if he can keep this up. Oh, Lord, look at that, man. So many minions everywhere. And it is the Minion Wars. The Avengers. Very nice use of the minion right there. Oh, Lord. Good 6 HS right there from Caffeine. Managed to hit Arania out of the air. King Strong Jacko actually is a spirit break in now seeing too. Then it is uh, it is mind-boggling, I would say. But it's still good, man. I like seeing Jacko play. I don't like playing against Jacko, though. But I actually love seeing Jacko play. It's actually pretty fun. Jacko players can block their own 2 <laughs> True that, man. True that. This man speaks the truth. <laughs> Yeah, though. Well, I think it, it can be applied to most, like, mirror matches. Like, Eno players cannot block the hover either, you know? <laughs> you know what I mean? So I can I, I can kind of relate. That being said, Aaron, yeah, man. Holy freaking lord. Already up 2-0. to zero. Good lord. Caffeine in dire straits right there. Definitely needs to find something to shape the tides, because this is definitely going all in Arania's way right now. Oh, lord. Caffeine already forced to pop the burst. If Caffeine out of the corner, but... 
Ernia does have one burst already. Here we go the Akuma ball in the guard point. Oh lord, what is that? Oh, nice bag dash right there from Cafe. And gets the grab. It's your turn. Like, hey, it's funny. <laughs> Look at the pressure. Ah, oh, wait, wait, wait. Caffeine backing up a little bit. Probably doesn't want to overextend. And fight the juggle using the minion into the overdrive. This is not going to kill us. It's too far from the corner, yeah. It would have killed. Oh, and he goes for the extension. This should be enough. Yes, it is. Good stuff from Cappy. Nice confirm and nice decision making right there. Yet finally gets one round. Let's see if he can keep this up. We shall see. Nice 6 p from Arania. Ah, uh, getting the corner pressure, the corner carry. Very nice back dash from Caffeine. Manages to get the 2D, uh, the whiff punish using the 2D. And on with the corner pressure. Caffeine looking pretty good. Went for the low, but nice blocks from Caffeine finally. From Arania, but finally gets open. Arania, uh, Caffeine going for the fully charged 2 uh, dust. Ah, oh, Lord. Nice, you man. Arania on point with this matchup, man. He knows exactly how to kill his own minions. Ah. Uh, and here we go to corner pressure. Arania going for the grab. Oh! Nice use of the RC to get out of entire range right there for um, Caffeine. Oh, Lord! And the jump in from Arania. Gonna get the corner pressure. Gets the opening. Forces Caffeine to pop the burst. Ah, Lord. Ah, here we go with the free. Ah, yeah. This is death right here. Good stuff from Arania on set point. Is he going to sink Cafe in the lose bracket? 3-0. That would be pretty sick. Ah. Ah, no. Unfortunately for him, no kill on Dominions. Ah, uh, couldn't quite whiff punish the 5HS either. Man, Arania on point, man. Ring with the kill of the minions. Caffeine finding the opening. Goes for the low, gets the juggle. And wants to keep the corner. So decides not to. Oh, Lord, in the tray. Woo! Good. BRC still the turn up. Oh, Caffeine finds the opening. Oh, and finds the opening with the quick drive. And the quick dust. Good stuff from Caffeine. Not out of this yet. Puts one on the board. The Jacko Bear. The Chaos Bear. Well, the. Not the happy girls, man. I mean, the. It is. Watching two Jackal play is literally chaos, I feel. More so even than happy chaos. <laughs> Good lord. But it's so. It is pretty entertaining to watch, to be honest. Perhaps this is proof that all Jackal players play the same. Nah, I do. F I do see some uh, differences in their set plays, personally. I find that Arania has a way more experience when it comes to. Like dealing with the uh, the dominions than caffeine it feels. Even though caffeine is really good at it too, but uh, yeah, I, I'm not too I'm I'm not familiar enough with the character in order to give a educated opinion on it. To be honest, <laughs> Happy Gas Mirror is just 2D Apex. <laughs> Fair enough. Anyways, here we go with Caffeine. Looking pretty good, but gets hit by the 2D counter. It. Here we go with the soccer freaking wall bounce. Look at the damage. Good lord, Jacko here playing soccer, man. Very nice duty. And the OTG kill for if Caffeine, man. Just one more and we will have a tie, ladies and gentlemen. Caffeine, bring it back. Very nice with punish. On the jump attempt from Arania. Soccer kick loop moment, man. That's it, man. We're, we're playing... Uh, how do you guys call it in, in English? We're playing FIFA. Uh, damn it. PS, Pro Evolution Soccer. I think you, oh, you call it Winning Eleven. Yeah, that's how you call it. We're playing winning 11 here on Guilty Gear, sir. And here we go with... Oh, Lord! Nice use of the uh, RC to get out of harm's way. Caffeine looking pretty chill. And he's gonna get the kill. We have a tie, ladies and gentlemen. Two matches apiece. A piece. Let's see how this spins out. Caffeine, bring it back, man. Holy freaking Lord. Okay, and on to the next battle. Ah, Caffeine trying to catch that bag dash from Arania with the 2D, but a little bit too far. And here we go with Caffeine in the entire on point. Uh, couldn't quite get rid of this minion, though. Uh, Ariel. Oh, no. Ariel minion messed up everything. And look at the freaking soccer loops in the corner. 
Very nice use of the RC yet again by Caffeine. Catches the back dash. And the decision from Arena to use a aerial grab instead of a natural attack in order not to get hit by the uh, the guard point from the minion. Narinia looking to try these shimmies, man, trying to bait that tech. Oh, and he gets the juggle with the minion. That was sick. Oh, and here we go with the soccer kick yet again. Arania on set point. What is Caffeine going to do? What is Caffeine going to do? Very nice use of the minion. And he's to hit Arania. Arania though. Oh, Lord. Four minions are getting killed left and right. Okay, and here we go. Yeah, plus 15 is pretty good, not going to lie. <laughs> yeah, it's always fun to have to deal with Jackal when you're in the corner. It's always very fun. Anyways, here we go with Arania finding this way, their way ever so slightly in the corner. Here we go with the Akuma ball. Ah, caffeine. Ah, finds the opening. Oh, goes for the low. Oh, and gets the bait. The burst, the burst bait. This is actually pretty bad for Arania because he goes on to the final round without any burst. Whereas Caffeine is currently having one. This is at the absolute worst case scenario for Arania. And look at both of them just running straight toward the other one. Very nice with punish from Arania. Manages to get the burst at least. Okay, no burst anywhere whatsoever. If you get hit, you get open. You have to hold it. Ah, and Arania won't like the 2 count it. We go with Caffeine with the juggle. Goes for the cross up. Forces Arania to pop the burst. The, the RC. Nice juggle from Arania, goes for the low, tries to go for the shimmy, but very nice back dash from, our, from uh, Caffeine. What the hell was that? That was a quick blue RC. Nice close S. Is this gonna kill it in? And Caffeine sends Arania in the loser's bracket, 3-2, that way. There we go, Subudi versus Suboy. Let's see how this pans out, the second winner's semi-finals uh, match. Let's see who is going to take it. For now, Caffeine is sitting in the winner's uh, final the winner of this match is going to uh, also face caffeine in the winner's final So definitely looking forward to this as well uh, Just one second please just checking the brackets real quick and everything is in order I love when things are in order that being said here We go with the 2k 2d from Osubuti trying to find the opening already got some to spend his burst by the way And a nice conversion station from Osubuti what is going to be the mix? Props to caffeine for facing many me Many mirrors in a game where mirrors are cancelled. I, I, I can definitely understand. Yeah, Caffeine had to face against Haruki. Not only uh, Aranea, but also Haruki, who is also another very strong Jackal player. So yeah, props to him to have to face again, to have to face so many Jackals. That being said, here we go with the second round and Tsuboy. Tsuboy just letting that DP rip, man. Oh, probably not very, very familiar or... Uh, not liking this rigid matchup, which can be understandable, I suppose. Maybe when Arc uh, 6 fixes servers, I'll get to play on Japan Towers. That may not be good. Where are you at, Larksa? Are you in uh, Asia? That would be nice, yeah. And here we go with the 2D counter from Usuiburi. Tsuboy finally forcing Usuiburi to pop the burst. We go with the trade. Ah, and Tsuboy, man! Got hit by the DP from Usuiburi. Here we go with the jump in. To be out. I'm not in Japan. Okay, okay. But you're in Asia, right? Anyways, here we go with uh, the corner. Oh, Lord, the mixes are real. Tsuboy going for... No, drops the combo. You're to see it. Oh, very nice jump out right there from Tsuboy. Goes for the low. And the confirms from Tsuboy just like this. He should be able to take it. Yes, he does. With the Ultra Toy come out. Tsuboy not out of this yet. Let's see how this runs out. Oh, very uh, trade. Both trying to make their way in. Tsuboy had the opening right there. Didn't believe in it. Ooh, and here we go with the juggles. Tsuboy going with the oh the midi yo yo. Air to air. Oh, Tsuboy with the cross up. Probably didn't intend it, but it was pretty cool. Ah, what the hell? You can actually do this? What was that? That was so sick. That was so sick. Chip moves so fast, he can whip punish nearly every way. Yes, he can. Definitely, he can. That was so... That that uh, that uh side switch combo from Usuburi without even using bar was sick. That was really sick. Rigid mix is somehow better than chip mix. Yeah, I can definitely understand that. Ah, here we go with the opening from Tsuboy. Should be able to get the wall burn. 
Let's see how this spins out. Ah, no anti right there for Rumps, boy. He gets a grab. Ah. Oh, that big 6p from Sumiri should be able to get a pretty nice corner carry. Gets the bait on the DP. Should be able to get... Oh, the wall break. I don't know if it was intended to get it so early. And here we go with the grab. Good stuff from Sumiri. Gets the second match as well. Tsuboy down to his last legs. Absolutely need to get three matches in a row if he wants to make his way to the winner's final. See how this spins out. Very nice standing P entire. And you can see he yeah, the checks from Usuburi. Wants to prevent Tsuboy from just running straight towards her. Ah, here we go with the closest counter hit. Ah, oh, Tsuboy couldn't quite get anything off of it. Ah, went for the overhead. And the wall run combo. Why is it going to be? Oh, the next one. Ooh, Usuburi getting cheeky. Going straight for Rock the Baby. But Tsuboy just, yeah, definitely saw it coming. Ah, yeah, Usuburi ah, gets out of the corner. Very nice city counter hit. And base the, the the DP wake up, but Tsuboy did have a bar to make it hit. Okay, Tsuboy not out of this yet. Needs the second one if he wants to make the start of a comeback. Oh, Lord, Usuburi being very nimble right there. Very nicely done right here. Oh, gonna get the juggle. Ah, Lord. Tsuboy in the confirms. Very nicely done. Is he going for the well break? No, he's not. Wants to keep uh, what wants to keep the corner positioning. Super Bridget, exactly. <laughs> I'd like to revisit Bridget since she's been buffed. Might be pretty fun to play. She was already fun to play before, so. Anyways, here we go with Oh the cross up from Tsuboy. Very nicely blocked by Usuburi. And here we go with Oh no, he's got that burst! Good burst, good burst. Very nicely bursted, Usuburi. Okay, Tsuboy not out of this yet. Puts one on the board. Let's see how this pans out. On to the next battle. Very nice 6p, man. Usuburi definitely looking out for these DPs. And Tsuboy, man, just wakes up with the DP. He loves to do it. Oh! Okay, both opponents uh, do not have any bursts yet. Tsuburi tried to go for the close test, but a little bit too far to get it. Yes, overhead is nice, but what about safe on block overhead? <laughs> It's the best type of overhead. What are these bursts? It's the burst fest, man. Oh, no anti right there, but it's still okay. Usuburi has uh, the pressure. Oh, and the big 2 HS. And here we go with... Ah, uh, the overdrive. This is going to kill. Usuburi, man, on set point. Was it? What it? What is Tsuboy going to do? We shall see. Here we go to jump in. Tsuboy and Diabare. Ah, oh, Lord. And again, the 2 HS strut. No! That was an unfortunate DB. That's boy is definitely going to eat a lot because of this. Oh, in the air to air. Is he going to get the juggle? No, too late. Slide for the juggle. We got the corner position, the corner. Oh, and the DB has been baited. This time around, it's Suboy. Well, look at the damage. He's one hit away. Ah, oh, no. Suboy didn't believe in it, but it's still okay. He can't potentially make a comeback. Okay, just one hit for Tsuboy. Oh, no. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Oh, Lord. Oh, that combo was sick. That combo was sick. The pickup from Usi Booty. Yeah, versus Takari. So these two have been playing against each other quite some time. I do believe that uh, Tatarin tends to win overall because he probably has a better track record than Hagera, but Hagera definitely no slouch. Definitely very, very strong uh, Jackal player. So let's see how this spins out. <clears throat> oh, and the air to air. Fortunately for Takari, he would have been in the world of hurt if he got jumped in right at that. Wow, Hagera going for the Golden Burst, man. Not afraid. Oh, very nice cross under from Hagera. And here we go, almost. They're getting forced to pop the burst to get out of pressure. Good lord. Ah. Okay, two minions on deck. I get I almost got the juggle. Oh, and here we go, the rainwater, man. That rainwater, you love to see it. The tech buster, man. I should, I should hear it. Is this a real Axel player? Yeah, he's impressive to get to. He is, he is the best Axel player in Japan, by far. 
by far. Uh, and yeah, he's just very strong. You'll see, you'll see. I, I think uh, he, he'll uh, hopefully he'll put up a good performance for the remainder of the tournament, which is usually the case. So wouldn't surprise me if he actually makes it to like uh, losers final or even grand final. Wouldn't surprise me at all. Axel players are a myth. This one is pretty much real though. <laughs> this one is really really strong. Again, here we go though. Yeah, you have to. Ah, oh, Lord, you have to hold it. You have to hold it. Yep. Dice give vision. Dice give vision right here. Yeah, nice jump in from Takari and the bait of the the the, the grab, man. He goes for the face cross up, but very nice block from Magan again, man. With oh no, no, too far to get though. No, he almost got the kill though. That was sick. That oh, okay, good two HS right there from Takari. Ah, yeah. Nah, and gets it by the minion. You hate to see it. First round. Oh, actually, no. Second round goes to Hagera. That's equal to say it was pretty sick, not gonna lie. Okay, and here we go with Takarin. Oh! The trade, fortunately, for Takarin, by the way. I guess jumped on, though. You hate to see it. Very nice for us. Got rid of the minion thanks to it, but got hit by the minion on, by, on the back. Where's the Axel Bomber? They're coming, they're coming, don't worry. Oh, uh, tried to go for the rainwater, but this time around, Hagiara was ready. Ah, nice. Oh, Lord, and the good from Is this gonna hit? Ah, that was a mistake, yeah. That was a input, yeah, error. That's unfortunate. Uh, uh, uh. I tried to go for the rainwater. Where's the actual Bombers? That was an unfortunate overdrive, man. The, the nerves are getting to them, man. Okay, here we go with the corner pressure. Ah, you, you love to see it. You love to see it. And just like this, Hagiara gonna take the first match, man. Good stuff from Hagiara. Brought it back. Ah, we are going Na to Nagori. get the Yuki is as well. I like how Ram is as well. But for me, the characters that are really, really just obnoxious and annoying to play against are... Uh, for me, okay? It's just my opinion, okay? I'm not, I'm not an authority on the matter. Please do not crucify me. But these are like Jacko, they're Gold Lewis, they're May. These characters are really freaking annoying to play against, like obnoxious. It's like, I, I don't know, I, I, I personally have a problem against these characters. Saying those words are, uh, has crucified you in the eyes of- Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Ah, okay, casual, I don't know. Even the pro community, people tend to agree that, like, Happy Cows, even, like, the, the big players tend to agree that Happy Cows is very, very strong and whatnot. Well, at least in the West, you know. In Japan, it's not so, I feel. Jacko isn't too bad to fight, in my opinion, but Mei's definitely needs to it. Oh, Mei is freaking... She's freaking annoying to play against, you know? You, like, you die in, like, literally one hit. It's freaking crazy. I, I don't know, I just don't enjoy playing against her anymore. I, I did enjoy playing against her in the previous path, even though she had supposedly more damage, which I don't think it was really true, but at least the freaking dolphin was in zero one block. Me, when I get hit by 5H, my fault. Yo, yeah, yeah, that's it. That's my fault, that's my fault. Yeah, exactly, that's, uh... That's the type of uh, sequence that we have a lot against me. But yeah, these are my uh, met my uh, personal... The matchup I hate the most, I guess. Yeah, May, uh, Jacko, Goldwiss. And um, I, I guess that's about it. Yeah, the rest is pretty much okay with me. Like, um, balance-wise, for me, it, it, the rest is pretty much okay, I feel. I think that Sol could, like... Giving him less damage would be... Bear, I feel also because he has a freaking hell of a high damage output, but that could be said for like a lot of other characters as well. I could ask for Zato Nurse, but that's more personal. Yeah, me too, you know. That's why I refrained from talking about them because it was more biased than anything. Buff the bed, yeah, bed man, buff that freaking bed man. I really, really want to see the bed buff man because bed man is so fun to play too. I dabble with uh, them a little bit, like uh, the, the first like two or three weeks, well, two weeks. Uh, when they came out, but it's so fun, man. The bed is so fun. It's so freaking fun. Just re-add red uh, RC Poration damage nerf. Yeah, yeah, that, that's... Yeah, exactly, you should do this. And you should, like, I just... You, you should, like, lower the damage for certain characters, not the whole, because, like, certain characters just... They cannot deal damage at all, I feel. But for Amlothal, I feel like Amlothal right now is okay. I don't feel like she needs anything. She doesn't really need any adjustment, in my opinion. Personally, I feel like it's okay right now. She's, you can deal with her. I feel. Other than bus for bed and sin and nurse for HC, possibly Melio. Uh, I think 
they were really... I think that Leo is good as he is. I don't think he needs nerfed either. Main needs... I, I feel like she does need uh, nerfs. I personally don't feel like Happy Chaos needs nerfed though. But yeah, sin bed buffs. Definitely, this is definitely. And as always, uh, buff, uh, keep buffing my dog Faust. I don't like playing against Faust. I hate playing against Faust. But the reason why I don't mention him is because Faust had some very bad matchups. So that's the reason why I've, I, I never really mention him. Even though I really feel like he's very strong and and that I would like him to get nerfed, I feel like it wouldn't be fair for Faust players. <laughs> Personally. Me when I get hit by Sol in your corner, my fault TOD. Yeah, exactly. Volcanic Viper, bam, you did. A nerf to positive bonus would be the best system change in my opinion. Uh, I agree with you as well. I do. Because you do get infinite pressure in the corner if uh, you are on the offensive end. And uh, you got the opponent, the opponent in the corner and you have like positive bonus with already one bar that was on. Then you get pretty much like infinite pressure and that is, uh, in my opinion, not very, very fair. Uh, also, Baikin gotta get cooled down a bit. That H Kabari follow up buff with Sevi. Um, this one also, I'm a little bit biased because uh, Baikin versus Eno is really, really, really annoying for Eno. So I don't know if it's something that's recurrent for every single character in the cast. Like, is Baikin really, really strong? Or is it just me uh, playing Eno that just gets completely pummeled by her? I don't really know if it's the case. But I personally really, really hate. <laughs> The Baikin matchup as well, but it's not as bad as like the other ma matchups I, uh, I I mentioned previously. Just please don't make my boy a top tier. Oh, are you talking about Faust? I think Faust is pretty good right now. I, I I feel like he's pretty nice. I think Chaos is fine now. Yeah, me too. I feel that he's fine. He's fine. Faust is strictly never seems to get nerfed in patches. Yeah, yeah, I, I do agree. The jackpot items in XR were technically a nerf, but it was a fun ass nerf. Yeah. You need a brain to play Baikin. You just alternate between Mash, Parry, Yozansen, and Wake Up. But then again, that can be pretty much be applied to any character in Guilty Gear Strive, I feel. Oh, my boy is Sin. Oh, yeah, I agree with you, Marissa. Completely. Completely. Yeah, Sin needs them. Uh, ne Sin needs some love. Sin definitely needs some love. But, um, yeah, Baikin is like, ah. Uh, I feel like I'm biased. If I, if I complain about her, I feel like it's more biased than actual... Uh, you know, uh, uh, like general like complaint, because I really just feel that Eno versus Baikin is like god awful for you. Pot gets any buff? Yeah, go. Oh. So I feel like Pot, if he gets buffs, Pot cannot be like middle tier. Pot can either be low tier or top tier. He cannot be in the middle. I feel like his archetype, his character archetype. And the way that he's made in this game makes it so that if he gets one too many buffs, he's gonna basically move from low tier to immediately like god tier. I don't, I, I, I really feel like it's gonna be the case. So I'm always very, very, um, I'm very, how do you say? I'm always uh, very careful when I, when I ask for buffs for, for a pot because I always feel like he's one buff away from being god tier. I don't know why. And Anji, yeah, the eternal lord here. <laughs> Thin getting too buffed could be a problem. He has the potential to be a problem, so I'd rather to go with the side of Pot. Yeah, I see. Pot will never be buffed. Dice K hates him. Arxis hates him. Yeah, it's understandable. I can understand why. Apparently, XR uh, Pot was cancer incarnated, so yeah. I've been learning Anji just to fight Baikin, and even that is still pretty bad for me. <laughs> really? Is, is Anji viable against Baikin? Okay. I wouldn't have say so, but Gilgamesh probably doesn't agree either, but... If I could only have one thing, give me a real Bagdash, his Bagdash should be not worse than heavy- Well, yeah, I can see, I see. I do not think uh, Pot needs buffs as a former Pot player. Okay, fair enough. Never forget better Pot. Apparently it was completely busted, yeah. They're gonna make Garuda impact plus 50 on block, hell no. Please, no. Fuzzy jump, Garuda is easy. Uh, Garuda is, yeah, if you have, like, the fuzzy jump down, Pot- Pot's pressure becomes pretty trivial. Well, you still have to get sometimes if- he knows that you're using like fuzzy jumps and whatnot, but for most of the time you can definitely like deal with pot very easily if you have like a fuzzy jump. If your fuzzy jump are on point, I feel. So, um, so yeah, that's about it. But I still feel like pot is really just one buff away from being god tier. Like if they buff him like one too many times, he's gonna. I, I swear to God, he's gonna like he's gonna rise from top uh, low tier to immediate like god tier right away. I don't know why. I, it's the impression I have. But yeah, 
that's about it. Yeah, but personally for me, if I ask for changes in the game, I would like May, Jacko, and Gold Lewis to be reviewed. Well, May just to be nerfed, and uh, Jacko and Gold Lewis to have their set play changed because the way they're they're built right now is like infinite pressure in the corner it's like i really really hate i should sub uh bridget just for this particular matchup any experience versus gold lewis sometime yeah man I, i'm i'm getting i get blowed by gold lewis's every single time like every single time i don't recall the last time i won against a gold lewis it's crazy uh not in celestial yet though we'll have to go look in parks there's never gold lewis in floor 10 blue i see, I see. but the ones in celestial japan are pretty pretty freaking hard that being said, here we go with Hoshino! Tried to go with the, uh, oh, the jump in, but he immediately burst it to get out of pressure. Here we go with Hoshino and the minigun. Oh, gets the opening and the juggle. Oh, goes for the freaking low. That was sick. Okay, Hoshino first round goes to Hoshino. Let's see how this spins out. Okay, ah, D going for the Beyblade. Gets the, uh, confirmed. Gonna get the wall break. Yes, he is. Nice damage right here, holy freaking lord. That being said, D does have a lot of blood already amassed. Probably wants to uh, be a little bit uh, careful. Here we go with the 2D, the 2P, huh? <laughs> freaking 2P, I hate you. I love fighting Gold Lewis, but that's only because I love his dub voice and Faust as a favorable matchup against him. Okay, that, that makes sense. Yeah, that's why I think I should switch to like Bridget or like a, um, like a character that Gold Lewis really, really like doesn't enjoy fighting because doing like if you play Eno, you have to play you have to get close to gold lewis you have to like interact with him if you want to win the, the, the match and that's where it gets really tricky because if gold lewis actually guesses right on one of your uh wake up options and uh like gets a 2p in and then behemoth your ass you get hard knockdown and then you're pretty much like guaranteed you're gonna die like not guaranteed but you have to you have to guess the right twice in a row or you're dead basically that's what i i don't really like in this matchup that's why i want to play a character that doesn't really have to interact with gold Lewis in the future who can just hit him from afar and like don't really worry about his close pressure or whatever you know anyways that being said here we go with hoshino going with the behemoth gonna get the juggle this is gonna kill by the way and it is yay a friend of mine a pot main uh, absolutely hates the gold Lewis. oh well let, well, we're, we're probably one of the same type then, because I absolutely despise this matchup as well. I don't like the Jacko matchup either. Anyways, here we go. And here we go with Oshino going with the Behemoth. Yes, the overhead. I tried to go for the overhead, but very nice match right there from D. Manages to get out of the corner. Finds the opening with the clone. Now gets hit by the mine though. Ah, the mine's level wasn't high enough in order to deal a hard knockdown though. Here we go, the jumping 2D. Everybody loves this move. Oh, and D going for the quick dust. Is this going to kill? Yes, it is. Good stuff from D. Put one round on the board. We have one round apiece, but one match for Hoshino. Let's see how this spins out. Oh, nice close S from D. Catches the back dash. And D with the nice damage right there. Look at that. Damn. Oh, nobody bowed, no! No, not my burst, but Silky saved by the bell. Oh, Lord. D got saved, man. He was so... Oh! Nice shimmy right there from... D goes for the double. Oh, and he gets a paper. No! The missed time for us! Oh, this is gonna haunt him until the end of the days. But Silky uses the clone to freaking... To go through the mine, that was sick. He goes for the grab. What was that shimmy? That was so strange. <laughs> that shimmy at the end from D managed to get the grab though. That was so sick. Oh lord. Good stuff from D, man. That was sick. Good stuff. Good stuff. Got the grab at the end. Got the kill. Oh, I tried to go for the command grab, but unfortunately too far. Woo! Nice behemoth from Hoshino gets the knockdown again. Goes for the cross of behemoth. Here we go the close pressure, but Oshino with the mash. Gets the opening. Oh, and here we go the juggle. This should be enough to kill. Yes, it is. Good stuff from Hoshino. Gets the kill. Ah, oh, good lord. That was sick, man. Okay, here we go the far K. D going with the back Fukio. Here we go. With oh, careful your blood level. But it's okay. D got the bite in. 
Here we go to close this, close this. Ah, uh, no. Here we go to cross up. Woo. Nice forest from D. Gets the juggle. Should be able to get the kill. Or not, actually. Not enough to kill. That was unfortunate. Ah, sorry, I'm around behemoth. You love it. And here we go to the 2S for the kill. D actually putting up a good fight. We have a perfect tie right now, ladies and gentlemen. Two matches, two rounds. Ah, oh, nice backdash on the standing S, man. That was sick. Here we go with the forest from Hoshino. Gets the opening. Goes for the behemoth. Ah, uh, no entire from the... Hoshino finds the opening with the behemoth. Again with the behemoth. Ah, and the jumping D counter it. And here we go with Hoshino getting the kill with the 2k into uh, the behemoth. And Hoshino takes the lead 2 to 1. On to the next battle. Who is going to take it? Oh, nice check from Hoshino. And D we gave up with the golden burst. Gets the freaking. Oh, nice. Gonna get the wall break. Oh, nice 6p from D. Gonna get the OTG as well. Caps his back dash with the close S. Gets the clone to hit not only the uh, the the mine but also go Lewis and this is going to kill yes it is yeah this is there good stuff from D he's the first round of the third match the fourth match let's see how this spins out uh, yeah D man D my boy you're spending a little bit too much blood there careful. Nice swift punish with the 5HS, man. Woo! Oh, no. Almost got the jump, and he ate this hit. And D getting hit by everything under the sun. Nice block on D. Cross up. Behemoth butt gets juggled. Uh, this should be enough to kill. Not enough. Here we go to mine. But she's going with the everywhere. And gets the kill with the 2P catching the bag dash. We are on set point, ladies and gentlemen. Is Hoshino going to eliminate D? We shall see. Very nice close DP right there from D. Feels to get the juggle though. Yeah, does it? Push him with the jump in. Forces D to pop the burst. Oh, and the minigun. Don't bring a sword to a gunfight. And D with the confirms, but gets a wall carry though. But it's still getting rigged with the chicks yet again. From Hoshino, man. Ooh, that was close. Ah, uh, but D-Man, he has a lot of blood. Oh, this is going to do a lot of damage, by the way. Ooh, almost got the, the juggle. That would have been... Oh, he catches the back dash. Uh, is this going to... I really hope it does for him. Oh, it does. If he didn't kill right there, that would have spelled death for him. Nice stuff for D. Damn, we have two matches apiece. Is D going to make it? Damn, D with the comebacks, man. Not afraid, not afraid. What the hell? Start of the round with fully charged dust. Who does this? Who does this? That was sick. That was so crazy, man. D, man, hyping things up, man. Oh, here we go. The cross did the overhead. No. Oh, Lord. But Oshino, man, not happy. Not happy with this start of the round with D. Oh, he charged us. Good Lord. Unfortunate for him, though. Yeah. D getting out of here. That was sick, though. <laughs> Let's see if D can bring it back again. That was so sick. Anyone does that, I'm hyped for them. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> obviously, man. Oh, that was sick. Man. Oh, here we go. The, the DP count it. DP count it. Okay, D being a little bit more cautious this time around. Uh, trying to catch Oshinu pressing button. Uh, try to get the freaking entire of the... <gasps> Ooh, nice side switch from Oshino. Yeah, forcing D2. Oh, no! That punish on the gold burst. This should be it. Good stuff from Hoshino. Takes it three to two. Went down to the wire. Uh, of, to boy, of chip. But then again, Takarin is very used to this matchup. So we shall see. I know that he hates the matchup, though. He absolutely abhors the chip matchup. But yeah, but we'll see how this spins out. We'll just see. We'll just see. Here's where we go to close S from Takarin. Okay, Takarin with the checks. Doesn't want boy to get too close to him. Nice trade for both. And here we go with the jump in by boy. Almost got the Alpha Blade. Oh, Lord. Ah, and again with the trade, man. And the Rainwater with the side switch. That was sick. 
And I thought I didn't go for the optimization station and the baits, man. That was sick. Good stuff from Takain. Gets the first match. Pretty good mistake. I'm not gonna lie. Nice air to air grab. It tries to go for the rainwater. No one home though. Then we go with the save drop. Ooh, the cross up actually. Again. Ah, Takarin caught pressing buttons. Nice box from Takarin, man. Bomber loops. Exactly. Nice stuff from Tsuboy. Finds the opening, gets the knockdown. Ah, goes for the overhead. And the wall run. They should be able to kill. Doesn't even need the wall break. Gets the kill. Good stuff from Tsuboy. Down to the next battle. The next round. Oh, tries to catch the back dash using the Sukiyaki. Woo, big DP right there from Tsuboy. Very cheeky one at that. Look at the damage also. Holy good lord. Nice knockdown from Takain. Should be able to. No. Doesn't quite get it. Ah, no. I die right there from Takarin. This is very unexpected. Ah, oh, and nice on back H. For Takarin gets the kill. Takes the lead once a zero. What is Tsuboy gonna do? Takarin no stranger to the chip matchup whatsoever. Let's see how this spins out. The shield goes for the overhead, but no, Takarin was on point with it. Takarin the wall, man. Ah, gets jumped on the. Oh, Lord! And you're good to boy catching that back dash man with the two S. Nice knockdown goes for the Alpha Blade mix up goes for the empty low, goes for the uh, the overhead the 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 cross up again. They should be able to kill. Good stuff from two boy. And not enough to kill, but it's still okay. He's got the conversion station. Look at that, two boy doing some freestyle right there. Good stuff. That was sick. Good stuff from two boy. Let's see how this pans out. And here we go with the checks from Takari. Oh, Lord! That's six feet low. Okay. And here we go with the jump in from Tsuboi. Yo, nice. How are you doing? Ça va bien, nice. Ça fait longtemps, gros. Ça fait plaisir. Je vais très, très bien. I'm doing really good, man. And I hope you're doing good as well, bro. And here we go with the wall break. Tsuboi's life sitting on... Oh, gets the shimmy! That shimmy was dirty, man. Actually, it's about getting the lead. Oh, he's gonna get the wall break? Yes, he is. Ça fait quelques jours, ça. En effet, mais quelques jours, c'est une éternité pour moi, mec. <laughs> J'espère que tu vas bien, en tout cas. And here we go with... Oh, Lord, the whip punish from Tsuboi! Good stuff! Good stuff from Tsuboi, man. Gets the kill. We have one match apiece. Good Lord. Again, on to the next battle. Oh, Takarin getting that DP punish, man. And look at the damage, though. I'm still in awe from the damage. Récupère tranquille et toi, impatient du SF6. Enfin, de la bêta. Ah, mais moi, et moi non, mec. Par contre, la bêta, je vais pas pouvoir y jouer parce que je serai pas au Japon à ce moment-là. Je vais, je vais à Guam pour un petit voyage tranquille. Donc, malheureusement, je vais pas pouvoir y jouer. Mais euh, en tout cas, ouais, j'ai hâte de jouer SF6. Et de plus, merci. Ah, c'est le mois prochain, donc c est, c est, ça va être pas mal. Ouais. J'ai hâte de jouer avec Yami, ça va être génial. Ok, on to the next battle. Good, 2k, 2d from Tsuboy gets the knockdown. Best find the opening. No, I die here. Oh, I'm sorry, I mistook the date of uh, the competition. No problem, Happy George. It's okay, bro. No, no worries. Yeah, I'm sorry. I It's actually my fault. I uh, I didn't... Uh, it was I put it on the 17th, but it was actually today. So I'm sorry, Happy George. My bad. I'm really sorry. <laughs> Anyways, here we go with uh, Tsuboy forcing that DP, uh, forcing that burst. Ooh, almost got hit by the water. Oh, Rainwater, no punish right there on the 6 HS. Oh, Lord. And here we go with the jumping K from Takarin. Gets the kill, takes the lead 2 to 1. Anyways, here we go. On to the next battle. And yeah, uh, Tsuboy, thank you very much for the raid, man. Much appreciated. Hope you had a very nice stream. And uh, as always, thank you and welcome to your community. This is the Brojo Cup, the weekly online tournament in Japan. We are currently in the, not the winner's semi-final, by the way. We are in the loser's bracket. Let me update this. This is the loser's bracket. I didn't update it. Uh, this is the loser's bracket, and we have uh, still a uh, few matches to come. So, hope you have a nice day, and if you have any questions, do not hesitate to let me know. 
Anyways, here we go with Tsuboy getting- Oh, the one bank! Oh, almost got hit! Got hit by the two HS, but, but managed to block it there. Ooh, here we go, the rainwater. Rainwater again, Ben, the DP got made it! Yeah, oh no, no entire, no air to air, oh! Oh, and here we go, it's Tsuboy getting the kill with the jumping to the very nicely done. Tsuboy not out of this yet. Hopefully the controller issue won't come back again. Here we go to 2D, oh, Lord, in the jumping from Tsuboy, gonna get the jungle. Okay, here we go with the checks from Takwani, man, that man knows. You fera un tournoi weekly sur us? Yeah, je vais en faire un, ouais. Je pense que je vais alterner entre... Euh, bah, je vais alterner euh, une semaine Guilty Gear Strive et une semaine Street Fighter 6. Bon, par contre, je suis pas à l'abri de passer full Street Fighter 6 si, euh, si vraiment la, la motivation me prend. Il y a moins que je passe full SF6, donc euh, je sais pas, on va voir, on va voir. Ça, dé ça dépendra de ma, mon niveau de motivation. Anyways, here we go. Ou alors, si ça se trouve, je vais rester complètement sur Strive aussi, hein, c'est parfaitement possible. Donc on verra bien, on verra bien. Ça dépendra de, mon, de ma motivation. On te connaît donc tu as passé full... <rire> On sait pas, on sait pas. Honnêtement, on sait pas. And oh lord! Tsuboy getting that kill with the overdrive. That was sick. Good stuff from Tsuboy. Puts one on the board and we're going on to the last match. Ladies and gentlemen, Kami everything. Mais j'aime bien Inno aussi. <laughs> j'aime beaucoup Inno aussi. Non, honnêtement, je sais pas. Je dis. Pour l'instant, ouais, je... bah, tu me connais. Hein. Enfin, moi, je... je viens de Street Fighter de toute manière. Donc, il euh, y a de fortes chances que j'y retourne. Surtout que, enfin, SF5, c'était pas vraiment le. Le Street Fighter que j'ai vraiment le plus apprécié et pourtant je l'ai joué comme un fou. Donc si ça se trouve, ouais, si, euh, Street Fighter 6 comme j'ai l'air de vraiment bien aimer. Il y a bien moins que, ouais, je, je le dose mais comme c'est pas permis quoi. And here we go, it's Tsuboy man, getting that freaking corner and combo very nicely done on set point. What is gonna happen? Good lord. Ah ok, very nice jump in from Takarin, gets the optimization station. Oh, nice stuff from Tsuboy, goes for the cross-up. Gets the juggle. Ah, uh, tries to go for the alpha, the gamma blade, but a little bit too far. Ooh, nice entire right red there from Tsuboy, goes straight for the overdrive. Oh, Totoi, come on! Oh, Lord! And he gets the freaking kill! Tsuboy moves on to eliminate Takarin! Good Lord, that was sick! Anyways, next match is gonna be Aranya versus Hoshin. Let's see how this spins off. This is actually a matchup I am looking forward to. Because I hate both characters, so I want to see one of these characters lose. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Yeah, let's see how how uh, how both of these characters fare against their own pressure, basically. Because, I mean, it's pre pretty much the same principle. Like, having uh, like overwhelming pressure in the corner and forcing the opponent to press a button and then opening them up once and killing them, basically. Or chipping them to death. So in that type of sense, like both characters' pressure is pretty similar in my opinion. So it's yeah, I'm pretty interested to see how this is going to pan out. Mais j'hésite entre Julie et Zoner. Mais j'ai l'impression que vu le gameplay accessible etc. Très proche etc. Zoner, ouais. Zoning, ça risque d'être un peu compliqué dans Street Fighter si j'avoue. Hein. Donc mais Julie a l'air euh, Julie est vraiment vraiment fun à jouer. J'ai joué pendant les deux bêtas, enfin les plusieurs bêtas là qui qui était dispo et elle est vraiment super fun à jouer. And first match goes to Hoshino pretty quick by the way. Let's see how this spins out. That went very very quick. What is Arania going to do? We shall see. Yo Mugi! Ohayo gozaimasu again kite shouka. And okay here we go on to the next battle and you can see Hoshino Ooh, getting hit by the Akuma fireball. Ah oh, good lord. Oh good lord. That big counter hit on the behemoth. Hoshino going for the cross of Behemoth. Behemoth land. Oh, very nice use of the minion to hit Hoshino in the back while he had the uh, mine. Oh! Alright, yeah, with the burst bait. Quel zoner? Uh, JP ou Dalsi? Là, j'avoue, il y a plusieurs zoners. Enfin, techniquement, Ryu aussi est un zoner. Ou, comment il s'appelle, la Gaël? JP. JP, il a l'air super marrant. Jean-Paul, mon pote. Jean-Patrick, Jean-Pascal. Anyways, here we go with uh, the corner pressure. Ooh, Lord. Knife with funny from Arania. Getting the soccer loop. Look at the damage for gold. This is actually pretty high. Here we go the blue Roman cancel. Very nice confirm from Arania. Can get the wall. Corner. The corner pressure. 
Ah, trying to force that wire, I see, man. And it should do. That went extremely quick. <laughs> that was extremely quick. Good stuff for Amarnia. Getting the kill doesn't even need the wall splat. Puts one on the board. Let's see how this spins out. Let's see how this spins out. And on to the next battle. Was you know taking things a little bit more slowly this time? Very nice guard point right there from Arania to prevent Hoshino from swinging that behemoth around. Oh lord, Arania got open! And here we go, the minions are on deck! Very nice use of the guard point. And by Arania, still got hit a little bit by- Oh, very nice shake right there from Hoshino. Is the entire- Oh lord, and Hoshino with the kill, the quick kill. That was a very, very quick, uh, a very quick round. Oh, nice enter from Arnett. For fortunately for him, it was a trade, but did manage to enter Hoshino nevertheless. Nice grab from Arani, yeah, man. Goes for the fake cross up. Oh, nice guard point. We go with Arani, yeah. Goes for the full E-Trudge, does! Good lord, Arani, the disrespect! Well, it's not really disrespect, I mean. If you didn't lock it, it's your fault. Okay, nice checks right there from Hoshino, trying to get rid of the minions, but gets scooped by the 2D counter hit. And here we go with the OTG for the kill. One round apiece, one match apiece. We have perfect, a perfect tie right now, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, here we go with the jump in. Very nice confirmed by Arnia. Goes for the cross up. Goes for the... Oh, the fake cross up this time around. And here we go with the grab. Arnia with the snaps. Tries to open. Was it not? Was it not in dire straight? Gets hit by the minions. You go to your bar. Oh, Lord! Was it not with the jumping? Ah, uh, yeah, you can see Arania trying to bait that where I see, man. Trying to bait it so bad. Oh, Lord, that was almost behemoth in your face. Very nice stuff from Arania with the guard point. Okay, and here we go. Back to the. Ah, uh, back. Oh, no! Oh no, Hoshino! Got it by the Akuma Fireball and Arania taking the lead 2-1. Hoshino in Dire Straits right now does seem to have some good decision making, but man, Arania man just on top right now. For ça que je crois qu'il serait Dalsim le... Je crois qu'il qu serait Dalsim le meilleur zone. Ah, carrément, Dalsim il va être super casse-couille hein, durant sur Street Fighter 6. C'est sûr de sûr. Là, tu peux en être certain. C'est sûr. Surtout que maintenant ils ont facilité sa TP, donc il va pouvoir faire sa TP juste avec une direction et trois boutons d'appuyer. Donc il va pouvoir euh, bien punir les drive rush euh, en réaction. Ça va être assez ouf à mon avis. Anyways, here we go with Hoshino punishing that 2D. Very nicely done. And Arania in the corner. This is probably gonna go down to the wire. Ooh, already a scoop by the behemoth. And just like this, man, Oshio oh, taking it with a perfect two matches apiece. What is going to happen? We shall see. Let's see how this spins out. On to the next battle. Ooh, here we go. The jump in by Oshino. Oh, goes for the low. Ah, uh, nice attempt to whip punish. Very nice stuff from Oshino. Using his far key to kill the minion and then the behemoth to, uh, for the follow up. Should get a juggle right here. Ah, goes for the overhead. Wow, that freaking call out from Arnie on the fake cross up. Woo! Okay, good stuff from Arnie. Yeah. Ooh, nice guard point. Almost got killed right there. Wow. Here we go to jump in. Arnie trying to beat that YRC, but man, Hoshino not biting. Not biting whatsoever. Ah, uh, Arania getting the juggle. Failed to get it though, unfortunately. Uses the RC to extend the combo. Oh, here we go. The pressure's real. Oh, gets the shimmy. Gets the shimmy. And the soccer loop for the kill. Damn. Arania taking the lead. Par contre, maintenant, j'aime pas du tout le gameplay. Ouais, maintenant, je J'aime pas le gameplay, j'aime pas la DA. Enfin, j'aime pas le style du, du personnage. Et euh, j'aime pas la gueule du personnage, il y a plein de trucs que j'aime pas chez Manon. Donc, euh, mais bon, on verra bien. Vous voulez la thèse car elle est française, mais le gameplay. Ah, moi non plus. Euh. Gameplay, l'animation du perso, la gueule du perso, l'archétype du perso aussi, il y a rien qui me plaît. Hein. Mais bon, après, par contre, je peux comprendre l'attrait pour certaines personnes, mais moi ça me. Moi j'ai zéro hype pour le perso, genre 0-0 quoi. 
Anyways, here we go with Oshino going low, trying to find the opening, forcing Arnia to pop the burst, but I'm pretty sure Arnia will not pop the burst whatsoever, wants to keep it in the event that he has to go to the... F ah! Oshino popped in the burst. And here we go with Arania. Oh no, doesn't have a minion anymore! Air Hoshino is in the house, yo! And Hoshino taking the kill with the OTG, but Arania does have one burst that Hoshino does not. So that might be an uphill battle for Hoshino against the Behemoth, man, so far. Woo! Okay, nice back dash gets in by the forest. Nice freaking... Ah, oh, the checks are real! Hoshino goes for the overhead, overhead again. Ah, uh, you have to, uh, you have to hold it, you have to hold it. Here we go, the low, and this should be it. No, not enough to kill. Oh, here we go, the jump in. Arania not out of this yet. Goes for the low. Goes for the cross up. You're in mixed land. Goes for the big cross up. Oh, goes for the cross up. No, not like this. Oh, I saw the word. Here we go, the bar for Holy man, and just to take it. By the skin of his knee. Quand elle est, euh, quand elle est assist. Ah, je joue, je joue. Bientôt show. <laughs> je joue. <laughs> oh, we're in winner's final now. Yes, we are. This is the winner's final. Kimberly, yes, yeah. Kimberly, yeah, it's not my type, but yeah, she's a, uh, she's fun to play, I guess. She's definitely, she seems fun to play though. She definitely seems super fun to play, but not really my type of character. I'm gonna stick with Cami. Cami, my waifu. <laughs> Anyways, here we go with Sweet Booty in the corner. Look at the freaking... Look at the pretty nice damage right here. The Sweet Booty gets the wall break. Gonna get the positive bonus. The Yo-Yo is out. And Roger is out as well. Okay, Sweet Booty trying to find the opening. Tries to jump in, but Caffeine was ready with the 6P. Okay, Caffeine finding his way out of the corner. Ah, no entire... Yeah, uh, Sweet with the life lead though. But you think with the wall, with the jump in, should be able to seal it. No! Caffeine burst right at the end! Cain would get along with my wife. She loves Cammy too. Perfect. You should you should present her to me. <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. Anyway, here we go with. Oh lord, Sweet Booty getting that punish on the 6P. Ah, uh, tries to go for a grab, but Caffeine, man. Sniffed it out, but still got hit by the 2 HS. Follow up of Usuguri. Okay, and here we go with the freaking air to air. Usuguri on fire. On fire, desire. Good stuff from Usuguri. Puts one on the board. Good stuff, good stuff. Let's see if Caffeine can bring some sort of adjustment to his gameplay to bring it back. Wow, start of the round two D counter hit. Oh, Lord. Kimberly. Exactly, Kimberly. <laughs> Damn, that brisket roasting caffeine. I know, right? Yeah, I don't know. The Suburi is so strong. Holy freaking lord. Anyways, here we go with. Oh, nice 6 period there. From caffeine to blow up uh, the 6 H. The, the, the 4 H, I'm sorry. Here we go with caffeine trying to bring Usuguri in the corner. Nice 6 P from Usuguri, but here we go with the wake up overdrive from caffeine. Gets the hit. And gets the kill. Sometimes you just need to do it. Damn, that brisket roast in caffeine. Exactly, man. About two years ago, he played Cammy only on SF5. I never changed. Yeah. I played Cammy starting Street Fighter 4 still. I play her ever since the 4. I'm a big Cammy fan, man. Ever since I first started playing her, I never, like, played anybody else. Well, I mean, like, main ne ne anybody else. I did sub though, but I, did I didn't main anybody else. Yeah. I had a sweet Cammy on Street Fighter 4. Holy freaking boy. Anyways, hopefully I'll get a very good one on Street Fighter 6 as well. We'll see, we'll see. Anyways, here we go with Usui Booty trying to make his way to his cafe. And fight. Oh no! Almost got the 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 punish on the burst. Oh, but that being said, Cafe also almost got the punish on the burst. Both failing to punish each other's bursts. And having the opportunity though. <laughs> Anyways, here we go with uh, the corner pressure. Ooh! A nice yo-yo throw from Musubiri. Oh! I didn't read about that, but how is the netcode of 6? It's pristine. It is perfect. It is perfection incarnated. <laughs> no, seriously, it's really, really good. It's like... It's it, it's at least on par with that of... Uh, 
uh, Guilty Gear Strive. And I'm talking about Drift the Nickel, not the lobby system or whatnot. Lobby system Guilty Gear Strive is, is really, really bad. But the netcode, it's hard to complain about the netcode. Thank you Oh, RF-san! Latest state that I can get to the And here we go with Caffeine actually taking the first, uh, the second match, that being said. Let's see how this wins out. And on to the next battle. Oh lord, nice clash right there on Caffeine. Gets hit by the uh, pump start my uh, heart though. Pump start, jump start my heart. Pump start my heart. <laughs> And here we go with Usiburi finding the opening, goes low, but Caffeine with the back dash manages to escape it. Caffeine trying to put their minions on uh, the... Oh, yes, the punish on the burst! Immediately goes on overdrive for some added damage. This is going to do a lot of damage, man. Good stuff from Caffeine on the verge of taking this one. Oh, sends one minion in the air and manages to get the kill with the other. Maya very nicely done by Caffeine. Takes the lead. Let's see how this spins out. Very nice check right there from Musubi with the 2k 2d. And here we go with the jump in. Musubi trying to find a way in. Goes for the uh, the, <laughs> the Ninja Turtle <laughs> roll reset, if I might say. Uses Roger to apply some more pressure, not to lose his round, uh, not to lose his turn. Nice air to air grab right there from Musubi. Al goes for the freaking rock the baby for the kill and takes him with the perfect. We have a perfect tie, ladies and gentlemen. One round apiece, one match apiece. Usubiri with the jump in gets the low. Al tries to go everywhere, but Cappy didn't let him go with a dot minion, a throw. Oh, look at the 4 HS. Gonna get the drill. Almost got the drill, but it's okay. Goes for the twist. Can I hit? Ooh. Oh. Caffeine with the 2D counter hit! Oh, tried to go for the cross up, but couldn't quite get it. Oh, nice 6 right there from Caffeine. Almost got the juggle, couldn't quite get the kill. And no entire right there from Caffeine. Is somebody trying to find the opening though? I'll go straight, run straight, man. Probably trying to get the air to air grab once again. And gets hit by the 2K for the kill. Damn, Caffeine taking the lead 2 to 1. What is this? What are you gonna do? Usui Booty, what are you gonna do? <laughs> okay, and on to potentially the last match of this set. Let's see how this turns out. Caffeine trying to catch that bag dash from Usui Booty with the 2D. Which uh, uh, almost uh, already for top of the burst. Usui Booty holding that guard. Goes for the delayed drop down. Nice confirm from Musuguri is gonna get the not the kill, unfortunately. A little bit too high to get um the Roger combo. Oh wow, and catches the back dash with Roger. Good stuff from Musuguri. Not out of this yet, puts one round on the board. Ooh. Here we go with the yo-yo throw. Again with the yo-yo throw. Oh la! Good stuff from Caffeine manages to get out of the corner. Oh, here we go, the juggle and the side switch. Unfortunately for Caffeine, probably didn't want this. But goes for the quick dust combo. Ooh, Musubiri getting that nice corner positioning. Wow, and five. Ooh, that big 6P on the way down of Usuburi Gets grabbed by Caffeine, though. Caffeine with the big cross up for the kill. Just like this, we are on set point. Is Caffeine going to take it or is Usuburi going to manage to bring it back? We shall see. Nice empty low right there from Musubiri. Gets the corner carry. Oh. Musubiri uh, has to deal with the minions. Oh, there we go. Using jump start my heart in order to get. Uh, try to get the juggle using the 5 HS, but. Uh, not enough to kill. Copy is still alive. Probably gonna go for the gold burst. And gets it by the yo-yo. Good stuff from Musui Booty. Not out of this yet. Puts one on the board again. Two to two. Who is going to take it? Who is going to send the other one in the loser's bracket? We shall see. Here we go with the clash of the fireballs. Nice juggle from Musui Booty. Oh, gets jumped on though. Forced to pop the burst. Nice punish on the two. Oh, no entire right there. 
Capping trying to make their way out of the corner. Gets hit by the yo-yo on his way down. And here with the DP from Usubuti and the block strings. And Roger hitting Caffeine out, man! Holy freaking lord, that was sick! And the jump is to catch the backdash from Caffeine. Usubuti taking the lead. So he's going to take it. Oh no, try to go for it though. Grab the baby. Actually, not grab the baby. Rock the baby. Nice OTG damage from Kevin. Try to go for a backdash BRC combo for instant overhead. Oh lord, here we go with the clash. Yeah, Usubuti definitely wanting to find that opening that will give him the sweet, sweet taste of... Um, the win! Oh no, Kevin dropping that combo! Woo! With the two HS. Uh, Kevin does not want to be cornered right there. That goes for a lot of Akuma Fireballs right there. Akuma Fireball again. Woo! Oh, nice! Kevin not out of this yet, gets the kill with the minion! It is going down to the wires, ladies and gentlemen. What? Final round of the final match. This is the match that decides who is going to be in Grand Finals. Okay, Usubuti does have the corner positioning. Almost got the entire, but too late. Oh, Lord. Usubuti cornered himself, but it's still okay. I guess it by the minion, though. Nice juggle from Caffeine. Gonna get the corner positioning. Oh, Lord. Here we go, Duck. Yuyu is out. Very nice air to air right there from Usubuti to kill the minion. Whoa, no! Caffeine tried to go. Oh, no! Caffeine got his burst baited! And the optimization station kept Caffeine in the corner. Again with Roger hitting Caffeine, man. Good stuff. That was sick. Oh, and you were gonna grab him. Kusubuti makes his way to the grand final. Let's see how this pans out. So, Tsuboi versus Oshino. Bridget in top two, though. Yeah, that's sick, man. This is so sick. I'm happy. I like Bridget. Okay, and on to the loser semi-final. Let's see who is uh, going to win their way on to the loser's final to have a chance to fight against uh, Caffeine. We shall see. With Gamma Blade. Oh, Oshino almost got hit by the overhead. But very nice bag dash right there from Oshino. Forcing Tsuboi to pop the burst. That goes for the... Oh, the jump in. Oh, nice grab from Hoshino, man. Here we go with the mine. Uh, this boy has to uh, eat the pressure and is going to die because of it. Nice first round from Hoshino. Oh, Lord, that 2D, the 2P, man, that was sick. I'm pretty sure they're going to nerf this, this move in the next patch. I am fairly sure they will. And here we go with the cross-up and Hoshino, man. Hitting Tsuboi with every single trick in the book takes the first map. And on to the next uh, battle. Let's see if Tsuboi can find some sort of arrangement. Goes for the overhead. Ah, yeah. Inviting Hojiyo to press a button right there. Goes for the overhead. Goes for the... Uh, the charge the, the route in order probably to... Uh, to not get hit by a potential burst. And here we go with... Ah, oh Lord, Tsuboi, man. Going for the double over it. And gets the kill with the 2K TV. That was a perfect, actually. That was sick. Let's see if Tsuboi can keep it up. No entire... Ooh, gets it by the behemoth. Gets it by the behemoth. And here we go with the behemoth's time. Wow, that air to air was sick. Look at the damage. Yeah, uh, Hoshino trying to bait that DP, that, uh, that DP, uh, that burst, I'm sorry. Here we go with Atsuma ah, going for the cross up and oh, wake up DP. Nice stuff, nice setup from Hoshino. This matchup looks so miserable for whoever gets hit exactly. I we with the everywhere. Ah, Tsuboi finding the opening. Goes for the wall break straight away. Ah, oh, no, somebody got hit. And, but he does have the jump in. Good stuff. He's going to get the, uh, the corner carry. Goes for the alpha blade. No, drops it. And gets grabbed. 
This is a wake up DP or not. Oh, DP afterward. Good lord. And two boy taking it with the overdrive. Good stuff. Flashy way to win. <laughs> Good stuff from Tsuboy. Okay, one match apiece. Wiz going to take the second one. We're going down to the wire with this one as well. <laughs> oh, nice 2D counter hit. Gets the juggle. And the corner parry. Forces Tsuboy. Ah, but pushing him with the well timed burst. Forcing, uh, cornering Tsuboy. But that being said, Tsuboy already out of it. Oh, Lord, the jump in. Ah, Tsuboy. Dropping the, the... Oh, Lord. No. No burst for you. Oh, no. That was an unfortunate DP from 2Boy. That's what getting hit again by the cross-up. But it's okay. He's going straight for the overdrive. Not enough to kill. Here we go with the Alpha Blade for the kill. Boy takes the lead. One round, one map. Ooh, that was a very badly... Uh, that was an unfortunate blocked overhead for Tsuboy right there. Hoshino making the best out of it. Goes for the fake cross. Uh, gonna get the juggle and the kill. Yeah, this is dead. Bye bye. <laughs> we have a perfect tie, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna take it. Nice okay to the bite, Tsuboy. Getting the corner carry. Goes for the grab. And with the Gamma Blade to keep. Oh, wow. The bar from Hoshino, man. Still against the cross up, man. It's been working so good for him. Here we go, the jump in. Oh, Lord. And this should do. Yeah, this is going to do. Unfortunately, Tsuboy dies with his burst. This is really unfortunate for him. Is Tsuboy going to be able to shift the tide of battle? We shall see. Nice forest from Tsuboy. Still gets interrupted by that 2D, the 2P, man. It's only 5 frames, but this 2P is so annoying to deal with. Nice forest right there from Moshio. Gets the behemoth. Goes air to air against Tsuboy to catch him out and force him in a... In the pressure. Lord! And oh, finally Tsuboy out of the corner. Gets the punish on the minigun attempt. Tsuboy going out left down right every single where. Gonna get the wall break into the positive the positive bonus. Wow! And here we go, the kill! Hoshino using the invincibility frames of his overdrive and immediately Roman canceling it in order to uh to crack the safe jump from Tsubo and punish it accordingly. With the grab. Nice check from Hoshino. Gets the jump in. Wants that burst, man, wants it so bad. And here we go with oh the fake low from Tsuboy goes for the command grab, Lord. Oh here we go, Behemoth! Uh oh, air to air in favor of Tsuboy gets the hit. Oh Lord, you can change the chain. Oh! Tsuboy with the whip punishes. That was sick. Good stuff from Tsuboy. Okay, Tsuboy's still not out of it yet. Still needs the following match in order to stay alive. The loser of this match is elim eliminated from the tournament. Okay. No, and the back dash. Again with the back dash. Nice blocks. Sports boy. And the DB. Again with the grab, man. Three times in a row. It's been messing up Tsuboy so badly, this one. And the DP, man. Okay, Tsubo should get the side switch. He is... He's gonna get the wall break. The backdash in the corner has been working so well for Hoshino. Nice. Confirm is this gonna be enough? No, it's not. It's not! Careful, Tsuboy, if you go for a safe drop. And he goes for the alpha but for the kill! Good stuff from Tsuboy! Puts one on the board again! Brought it back, man. We are going down. It's going down to the wire, man. It's going down to the last round of the last match again. <laughs> Definitely going down to Oh Lord! Look with the behemoth! Nice whiff punish from Tsuboy. Works for the cross up. Nice block. Here we go. Closes. Closes. Ah, goes for the overhead. Wow! Finally, Hoshino forced to pop the power. Here we go. Cross up. Nice grab from Hoshino. Oh, empty low. 
Oh no, Sherry! You do not jump on me. You do not over. Uh, you do not command grab me. Nice 2S. Finds the opening. Probably goes for a. Yeah, you went for. Oh! Oh no! Not like this. Ah! That 2D. The 2P, man. The bane of everybody. The 2P of freaking Gold Lewis. Nice 2D counter. Ah, I couldn't quite get the. Oh, the double 6P, man. The double uh, forest. Nice whip punish from Tsuboy. Gets full punish. Gonna get the wall. Oh, yep. The wall run for added damage. And there we go. But yeah, Gold Lewis is just one hit away from from getting the win. Oh! There we go. Oh, no, the baby, man. Not like this. Not like this, Tsuboy. Not like this! Oh no, this is gonna do so much damage! Oh no! 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 <laughs> that was sick! It's going down to the last round of the last match. This is the freaking fourth match in the row doing this. <laughs> this is crazy, man. This is crazy. Okay, Hoshino, not out of this yet. Here we go with the DP. Nice back dash from Hoshino. That goes for the cross up, the bane of Tsuboy. Nice for us. Now oh, the jumping 2D is real though. Now Kiru with the low, Gamma Blade. Oh, no, and you did. <laughs> Good stuff from Oshino manages to eliminate. But at least thanks to this, we went to the uh, the absolute like final, uh, the final round. So it was hype, it was cool. The jumping gear is so cool. It is, yeah. The jumping gear of who? Of uh, Gold Lewis? This move is cracked, man. <laughs> so freaking cracked. I hate this move. <laughs> but yeah, it's pretty nice. Pretty nice. Anyways, here we go with uh, the pressure of caffeine. Hoshino eating his second Jacko in a row. Not in a row, but uh, in the loser's bracket, that is. Yeah, it just spins out. And if he wins, uh, he has to fight against the person who sent him in the loser's bracket, actually. So let's see how this spins out. I do believe Hoshino sent caffeine to the losers. No, I know he didn't. I'm dumb. Uguisuburi. Uguisuburi, I'm sorry. Not Uguisuburi. <laughs> Anyways, here we go. Oh, the jungle! The jungle, man! Oh, Lord, the jungle is real! Hoshino, man, wanting dead wires is so bad, but caffeine didn't give it to it. Though, anyways, guys, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go get a glass of water. Okay, here we go. No. Oh. Well, you know, taking the lead one uh, round to... Taking one round, actually. So let's see how this spins out. Oh, he gets the overhead. You hate to see it. Very nicely timed grab right there from Cafe. No oh, here we go with the Akuma Fireball. And what's you trying to navigate? Around all of these pesky minions, it is not an easy feat, not going to lie. Yeah, Captain really wanting to take it as slowly as possible, doesn't want to overextend. He knows that one hit is all it needs for Hoshino to bring it back. And he takes it with the Akuma Fireball. Nice decision making from Cafe. Manages to take this round. Oh lord. And here with the juggle from Caffeine. Almost got Hoshino in the corner, but Hoshino had burst in order to make it safe. Ah, Lord, nobody likes the behemoth. Ah! Nice 6P from Caffeine. Oh, Lord, almost got the punish on the whiffed uh, standing key. Oh, Lord, no! Hoshino, you've been pressing way too many buttons. And Caffeine taking the wall break. Oh, no, actually, no wall break for him. I lied. Oh, Caffeine got the bait on the bird, on the YRC. Good stuff from Caffeine. 
takes the first match pretty convincingly, not going to lie. Let's see if Hoshino can shift the tides of battle, we shall see. There's tides of battle indeed. Okay, and here we go with Caffeine finding the... Oh, the jump in! But yeah, Hoshino being very nimble, hard. Uh, definitely not letting Caffeine getting away with one simple jump in. Finding his way out. Forced to pop the burst though to get out of harm's way. <laughs> and here we go with Caffeine with the single hit. Confirm into the Roman cancel for extended combo potential. Yeah, Kevin doing a good job of keeping Hoshin away, man. Really, really a good job of it. Here we go again with the minions, man. Oh, Lord! Oh, nice struggle We're using the minion! And here we go! Oh, Lord! Nice block by Cafe. And gets the kill with the... Uh, standing D4K... D4H. Good stuff from Cafe. It's a pretty nice lead, but that being said, we go with the jumping D from Hoshino. Finds the opening. Oh, no! You hate to see it! This is gonna hurt! Wow! Look at the damage. Nice grab from Cafe. Goes for the fake cross of Get to the Jungle Forces or to pop the burst. Ah, nice. Oh, that's actually a pretty interesting idea. That's a very neat idea what he just did. Good stuff from uh, from Caffeine. I wasn't aware of this. Okay, here we go on to... Wow, that trade though. Thankfully for Caffeine. Where that would have spelled trouble. Nice juggle from Cafe. Gonna get the low. Gonna get the juggle. And it is pressure time. Uh, Cafe tried to go for a follow up after the a quick dust, but. Oh, yeah. Nice use of. Oh, no! Behemoth counter it. Oh, no! Got it by the overhead. Not enough to kill though. We go with the over it. Nice tech, man, from Caffeine. Oh, not enough to kill though. I call it, I'm calling it. Not enough to kill. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, the proration on the. Oh, but nice stuff from Caffeine. Still manages to take it, man. Damn. Takes the lead 2 to 0. What is Hoshino gonna do? We shall see. That was a sick round, man. Caffeine playing out of his freaking mind, man. He wants his run back against the Suibudi, man. He definitely runs it. He wants it so bad. Ah, nice clash. And the caffeine getting hit by the jumping D again. Ah, this is gonna do... Yeah, this is death. Death by Snoosh. Good stuff by Hoshino. Finally puts one round on the board. Oh, no anti right there. Again, gets jumped on by the jumping D. Caffeine has a jumping D problem. I can definitely say. Ah, oh, no. The minigun came out too quick. Here we go with the Okuma Fireball and the Behemoth counter it on. And as an anti-air. Ah, the pressure's real. Oh, no. Caffeine popped the burst. And unfortunately for him, got punished for it. Good stuff from Ocean puts one on the board. It isn't a problem if it works easy. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Okay, let's see. Oh, Lord! Oh, and here we go again with the behemoth. Wow, Caffeine have. Well, no, gets it by the jumping D again. <laughs> I swear to God, man. Like, most of the time that uh, Caffeine got opened up by. Uh, but got opened up, it was because of the jumping D. <laughs> I swear it's probably the most hated uh, move that caffeine. Well, for for caffeine. Let's see how this spins out. You're gonna see jumping D. <laughs> okay, this time around it didn't open him up. Wow, Hoshino playing out of his mind, man. Look at this. Look at this. Here we go to close pressure. Is the hit, and this should kill actually. Good move, my butt. Not enough though. Shy of just a pixel, and gets the kill with the 2K. With the perfect also, nevertheless. Hoshino, bring it back. Is it going down to the wire? Yes, it is, of course. 
We've been doing like final round final matches for the past freaking I think five matches or so. So yeah, it wouldn't it wouldn't surprise me if we go down to the wire for this one as well. Um Sabinia. Bear El Gav Gavin Force Bob the Burst gets jumped on by jumping D again. And the follow-up behemoth. This is gonna do a lot of damage, by the way. This is gonna kill, by the way. Good lord. Ah. Oh. Good lord. Okay, this is a set point for Hoshino. Gavin needs this one if he wants to stay alive. Tries to go for the shimmy, but Hoshino not biting. Hoshino swinging some big buttons right there. No entire! Yeah, you can see Hoshino noticing that Caffeine does not anti-air very consistently. And he's he's definitely using this to his advantage. Okay, finally. Oh no, the Bagdash! The prophesized Bagdash is back. Ah lord. Uh, no! This is death. Bye bye. Good stuff from Hoshino brings it back. He was down three. This is the grand final, the last set. Potentially if we don't have a bracket reset of today let's see how this pans out we have on the left side none other than usuburi today's uh well uh well usuburi sitting on the winner side of uh this grand final and hoshino needs to win two sets in a row if he wants to uh well to win the tournament basically so let's see how this pans out for now though usuburi is the person who has sent hoshino in the loser's bracket so this is definitely going to be an uphill battle for hoshino let's see if he can make it back though we shall see and here we go with uh, Hoshino and the pressure going for the grab. Oh no, actually getting grabbed by Usuburi. Oh, Usuburi going for the quick dust. Uh, not enough to kill. Oh, it is actually. Yes, it is. It probably will, I think. Come on, should. Yes, it will. Okay. Good stuff from Usuburi. Gets the first, uh, the first round. What is Hoshino going to do? Ah, nice air to... Uh, nice uh, trade. In favor of Hoshino. Oh no, no, not like this. Ooh, you almost died right there, Usubi. You definitely almost died. Yeah, and here we go. You have to hold it. You have to hold it. You have to hold it. I guess it by the mind, and this is gonna do kill. Good stuff from Usubi. Uh, from uh, from Hoshino. Puts one on the board as well. Nice air to air. Usubi gonna get the juggle. Forcing Hoshino to pop the burst. So let's see how this spins out. Ah, Usubudi getting the hit on block in order to get the extension. Gets the jumping, the juggle. Goes for the low. Nice conversion station. And here we go with Usubudi getting the wall break. Oh, what the? Oh, Lord. Almost got hit by the minigun, but still good. Okay, nice stuff from Usubudi. Oh lord, gets the conversion! And goes for the snow way! That was sick! Using the Roman cancel, quick Roman cancel in order to uh, can cancel it into the Rock My Baby in order to get the kill with the command grab. Good stuff from Ishib Usuiburi. Ah, Usuiburi drawing first blood, catching the bag dash with the 2D, the 2S, the 2S. Yeah. And gonna get the wall break. Yeah, he's bien chaud, Usuiburi. Oh lord, here we go with the trade in favor of Usuburi. Usuburi. Oh no. Still get. Oh no, still gets hit by the mine. The mine won't go. And here we go with the blocks. No, Usuburi getting opened by the overhead. Nice grab from Oshino. Yeah, goes for. Oh lord! The call out from Usuburi, man. Goes for the late jumping D to mess up with the uh, grab. Uh, okay. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, why not? Why not? Why do we take these? I think Usuburi is very comfortable with having uh, gotten just this amount of damage. Okay, good stuff from Usuburi, man. Knowing exactly when to press a button, man. Good stuff. Let's see how this pans out. Hoshino definitely not looking very comfortable with this matchup. Ah, no, and the jump in. The jumping conversion. Look at this, man. Look at Usuburi. Usuburi. And here we go with the resets. You have to hold it. He goes for the quick Roman cat or the quick dust. With somebody getting the wall break. Ah, a nice check right there from Musubudi. 
Ah, okay. Oh no, that was a mistime. Oh, that was so unfortunate. And no gold burst for you, Gold Lewis. Good stuff from Musubiri on the verge of taking this Brojo Cup, man. Holy freaking lord. Usui Booty. Definitely on point right there. Just go straight for the grab. Oh no. Hoshino falling apart a bit, not gonna lie. I get hit by the fire chest. Ah, and the jump H. Ah, this is looking pretty bad for Oshima, I'm gonna lie. Ah, here we go to far H. Oh, okay, finally gets the minigun in. Oh, nice box for Musubiri. Gets opened up though. Ah, the bar is real. Wow, that's 6 speed though. And again with the minigun. Okay, let's see how this spins out. Musubiri getting out. Oh no, he's got the YRC. I hate to see it. And just like this, man, Musubiri on tournament point. Is he going to take it? Let's see how this spins out. Is Oshino gonna be able to bring it back? Nice. Oh lord, the freaking standing HS for entire man. We take these, man. We take these. Good look. Oh, using Roger to get rid of the mine and also hitting Lewis. What is gonna happen? Here we go, man. Ah, the zoning is real. Yeah, the things are not looking very good for Oshino, man. Oh, gets the hit, though. Oh, gets the overhead. No, it gives you cross up. No entire. Ah, oh, gets hit by the forest. Counter hit. Oshino not going down without a fight. Nice. Oh, Lord. Now the jungle. Oh, Lord. And just go for the grab. And just like this. Oh, sweet booty, man.